Hi everybody, welcome to TV on. My name is Lauren Blair. Thank you so much for joining us and uh, happy Wednesday. Glad you're with us tonight. A very, very special show of what's new Wednesday and a lot of very, very cool ideas that uh, I know we're excited about. Like, uh, for example, we have a uh, pink zircon pendant. So for everybody who's been waiting for a pendant to go with your earrings or go with your ring, if you're lucky enough to have them already, or if you're just waiting for a really, really, really super cool, affordable way to get your pink zircon before they're gone and before they don't come back and before all that, you know what's happening with that mine. It's like one at a time stones, but this is our first time actually giving you a couple of options. We have been uh, kind of getting a few matched pieces in. So instead of making earrings, we're going to give you a couple opportunities on a pendant tonight. So pink zircon lovers, you're in luck. Also, a very, very important tanzanite in the bridge. This is the big bridge. This is the big one we do with uh, multiple, multiple rows underneath, all in pave, great big tanzanite as well. So that is very exciting. Also have, we have something very, very special for you. Two Elite Eights actually, and then a third wheel that's gonna be our very famous museum must go. So I know if you love the museum pieces and the high end, and you're just waiting for them to like crash down in price, we got that for you. And one of my favorites, Baroque pearls are here. We have the Tahitian pearls, but they're the Baroque style. So super beautiful, super cool, and so much more. It is gonna be a show. I would not go anywhere for the next three hours. Sit back and relax and uh, let the shopping come to you. Well, of course it is required. You call in. So that's where I again really, really recommend you dial in early. As soon as you see, see something you love, go ahead and get on the lines early because almost everything I have is limited to one or two or maybe three at the max. So it's going to be an exciting night to shop. Also, I want to tell you about a bracelet. We do have a Paraiba bangle. So for those of you that are again, if you're lucky enough to already have the ring or maybe the earrings and you want to really, really top off the collection, a bangle would be the way to do that. So we've got a Paraiba bangle and speaking of bracelets, the largest tennis bracelet TV on has ever had. You guys were admiring this earlier, right? I mean, it was like, boom, that one you don't miss. It's eight carats, actually a little over eight carats in size in a diamond tennis bracelet. So that I think is very, very exciting. So that's on the way as well. And it's all in 18 karat gold. So it's kind of like the magic eight ball, you know, like the magic. Remember that? Do you guys remember the magic eight ball? And you would like ask it a question and it would give you the answer. I just thought of that. I'm getting, I'm very nostalgic, you know, it's, uh, yeah, you know, very nostalgic as you welcome another year. I'm, an, I'm a year older since you saw me on Monday. And um, I got to just take a moment here and thank everybody, everybody, so much of the TV on family. I will tell you, it was the best day yesterday ever. And uh, in large part due to all of you guys and so many people, hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of you that reached out in one way or another from text messages to voicemails to emails to amazing social media, all kinds of messages. So thank you guys so much. Everybody who reached out, I cannot tell you how very, very special you made the day. So thank you guys so much. And of course, too, um, I had so much fun looking at the gifts. And you remember, Sandy, I hadn't opened her gift till yesterday. I waited till yesterday. Um, Sandy, the most lovely hand-painted leather tote bag. Uh-huh, Is so she knows I'm a handbag girl. Yeah, and actually what I didn't realize was Sandy's daughter shares my birthday, so it's extra special. So anyway, Sandy, thank you. And Marilyn, of course, and Judy, of course, thank you so much. Um, and, and everybody else. So thank you guys so much. You really felt the love yesterday and uh, helped make the whole day just feel a little bit happier, right? So very, very excited you're with us. Let's get started. We've got a, a really special, I thought we'd start with the uh, Maybear stone in a rare form because you don't usually see these stones match up in the highest of uh, superstar quality. And again, anything you want to see on this Wednesday, let me know. I'm here for you. Did I mention I'm Lauren Blair? I never do. I never do. <laughs> we seem to forget that. This is TV on. I'm Lauren Blair. Let us know if you have a request and take a look at our emerald earrings. We've got a gorgeous set of emeralds here. It's 43.93, and it is really, really rare to see that kind of bright, clean, glowing emerald at a match pair where they look identical. Because I see it all the time. We'll have a ring and I'll say, well, you know, it's a one of a kind because it's an emerald, right? That we understand. But look at this rare, rare pair. I'm just going to focus it here for you. And look, they've become even better. So you've got 53 points. Colombian emeralds remembering, of course, that they are always going to weigh less than they look like they weigh. So little incentive there. 53 points plus a halo. Of, why? Oh, there's no diamond weight. Cool. Those are free. I like free diamonds. 
love free diamonds and we've got them for you here in a halo design around your ovals and then there's a post and butterfly back and the post is going to be oriented to one end of the earring. So generally speaking, they're probably going to have more of a north south orientation on the ear, unlike what you see here, which is east west on the turntable. So anyway, we've got one pair probably goes without saying, right? And uh, all we got to do is blow it out. That's what we're doing on everything. So even when there's brand new, like what's really, you know, all throughout this What's New Wednesday, it's going to be a lot of big discounts for you, a lot of big sales, a lot of really huge, even pieces you have seen, you're going to watch them fly. As far as markdowns are concerned, it's pretty amazing. So not even $17.99. Let's blow them out. All oh, those beautiful, round, brilliant diamonds are there. Oh, and by the way, Linda, we've got your pendant too. So Linda wanted to see an Alexandrite pendant, so I'm hoping she likes what we got for her and that's coming up next but first first Kala I mentioned we do something crazy for you this is going to be 888 instead of the 1799 which wasn't even yeah we didn't even need to put that up that just that just you know I'm going lower on every little last thing we're bringing down prices to their all-time lowest and we do have coral we have coral coming up we have coral earrings actually I know we've had a pendant I know we've had studs we actually have drop earrings for you within the next couple of minutes there will be our first elite eight is going to be within the first hour which is really fantastic. And then these, oh, the, I mean, look at these. You want a little sneak peek of these Tahitian pearls, these gorgeous Baroque styles. What do you think of that? Yes, those are the large Baroque style pearls. We're going to show you with a solid gold clasp. Those are coming up, but I only have one of each color of gold. So that's why I wanted to give you a little sneak peek. They're huge jumbo. So those are going to be coming up, but let me know who's got these at 888. Then Linda, we're going to show her an Alexandrite pendant. I think she was shopping for her daughter actually. I love, I actually heard from a couple viewers in the last couple of days that they watch and shop with their mom. So it's a mom daughter shopping tag team. My mom and I do that too. You know, not necessarily, you know, at TV on, but you know, we do that. So, well, we, you know, we famously back when stores were open, we would sometimes, you know, she lives in a different state than I do. And sometimes we would go to a store and we would buy the same thing like for each other. I mean, it's happened multiple times over our shopping careers where we'll buy like she'll buy something that she loves and I'll buy something that I love for her and she'll buy for me and then oh they're the same thing I mean we're kind of right on with that whole understanding what we like right I mean it happens it must be a genetic thing right let's get to our next pear shape Alexandrite and those are here if you'd like them we're gonna wait I'm not really waiting on anything because we got a lot to show you throughout the show but I do have this which I know Linda she had a lot of specifics on what she's looking for but I got to tell you this is really it's tough to make an Alexandrite pendant super affordable and so we're going to do our best here and this is actually the only one that we have that's going to work in a pendant size right now but it's a really high-end stone it's 3358 it's a super super saturated alexandrite that comes out of where brazil we get our best alexandrites in the world out of brazil and this is a hundred percent color change material so you have a three by four pear shape which is about a half carat then you have a 28 point diamond weight where the entire pendant you've got the double halo you've got the diamonds in the bale all looking so fabulous and there's only one and I hope she likes it. It would be great for everyday wear. I think it definitely uh, checks that box as far as size wise. I think it's really, really done beautifully. But of course, diamonds galore. I mean, you could not, you've just covered the entire pendant with diamonds. That's not, of course, that superstar center stone in the Alexandrite. We've got one. It's not going to be $9.99 or $8.99 or $7.99. I'm going to blow it out. I know she had a, um, a certain price range in mind. <clears throat> this is absolutely as low as it can go. And we've got it for $699 only on our one Alexandrite pendant in the house. So that's it. And then we've got those gorgeous Baroque pearls that are coming up for you. So loving those. I, I gave you a little freebie. They're coming up like in moments. So you will not have to wait long for those gorgeous, precious, amazing Baroque pearls, which are just gigantic. So loving those. And Baroque pearls will explain what that is if you're not familiar, uh, where it's got the texturing to it. They're all natural. So they have kind of a natural shape. And it's not, it, it's basically an imperfect pearl, which is really, I think, what makes them so lovely and luxury because they really look like the real deal. Nobody's going to mistake them for like dyed pearls or faux pearls or plastic pearls or beads, right? It is the real deal. So that's our Alexandrite. Linda, we thought you might like it. You let us know and we can go back to the drawing board. I know um, she, we're just doing our best to try and get you a really, really affordable Alexandrite. So $6.99. Let us know if you'd like that one. It's a huge discount. Our emeralds are here and then let's get to those Baroque pearls since we only have one strand of each and they're really fabulous and actually they're the largest pearls we've ever brought to you as well and and uh, that's the Alex Pendant. Now let me show you first on the hand. We'll start there. 
This is a fabulous look, and I'm going to show you the difference here because I want you to think about, we've only got, um, on 1121, we only have one of each, and this is the yellow gold. The only difference here is going to be with the clasp gold color. So we have one in yellow and one in white, so that's perfect, especially, you know, I know it's a clasp, so a lot of people are going, but it's in the back, who cares? Yeah. But it's such a pretty clasp, you could wear it in the front because it's got that beautiful texturing to it, which mimics some of the texture of the pearls. Now, this is item number 1121, and you've got 14 to 16 millimeter natural black Tahitians. They're all the same size all the way around as well. They don't actually graduate like so many pearl necklaces do, where you might have the big ones down here, but then they get really small on the back. It's not happening going to be, and we say 14 to 16, because they're a little bit more oblong shape. They're not exactly round. You can see how some are a little bit more like a pear shape if we're going to, you know, compare it to a gemstone cut. Some are round, some are oval, some are a little bit more pear in their shape, but it's a really cool look. Let's go up close as well and show you. Actually, I want to show you the white gold because the white gold clasp is a little different. It's just a mirror finish clasp. So now that you see that and what's great about this kind of pearl is a the size, right? That's really important. So that's what the white gold and again, look up close. Here, I'll show you the yellow gold clasp as well because one is textured, one is not, one is smaller, one is not. But this is what we have here just one of each. So you're going to let me know whether you want the white gold clasp or the yellow gold clasp. Other than that, they're going to be, I can't say identical because the pearls are, again, all unique to each other. This is the beauty of having Baroque pearls. They automatically tell the world you're wearing the real deal and actually give you more, I think, judging on a lot of pearls I've seen over the years. I actually think these Baroque styles give you a little bit more color and a little bit more iridescent and it's a little more visible than some of your pearls that are more silver or gray or just kind of dull in their appearance. It's where you really see peacock colors, purples and blues and greens and all of that and a solid 14 karat gold clasp, a major size of pearl. We're going to go ahead and blow them out and if you would like a strand, there's one in the yellow and one in the white. That's everything and you can see the clasps there so you can see the difference in the clasp but this is really, really important to take advantage of, especially with this value, because Tahitian pearls are some of the most pricey pearls in the world. You just can't do anything about that. That's how they are. That's how they live. That's that's really what it's about. So it's, you know, this luxe look that for a long, long time was only available to royals. And it wasn't until actually more recently that they said, OK, you common folks can buy them. You're just going to have to pay the big bucks for them. So it's really, really exciting to bring you a great value on a major pearl. We're not going to make these $21.99. That's where they started. You've seen them before at that value. We're going to do even better than that. So if you love them, get on the phone lines, especially if you have a major preference on the gold color for your class. That's the difference there. 14 to 16. So they show up. They are huge. They are again. Some are a little more elongated. Some have that texture. They're really, really well done. They're going to be less than a thousand bucks. And this is one of the coolest looks I think you can wear in pearls. Take a look. They're not even $9.99. They're not even $8.99. We're only, again, we've got the last two here and we're blowing them out. They're such a sophisticated but cool look too. Because I think pearls have always got the, they've always got the sophisticated box checked, the elegant box checked, but I think cool pearls, this is where it gets really fun and organic, right? So not even $8.99. Blow them out. We'll do them for $888 while they last. James, did you have a question? Uh huh. Yes, Linda. I can't, unfortunately. We already did. So I know she wanted to be two or three hundred dollars. I can't do it. I, I just, I can't get to a two, three hundred dollar price point on an Alexandrite. So unfortunately, I know that's where she wanted to be. We we brought that down in relation to that. But hey, I'm sorry about that. That's that's going to be it. Yep, yep. I, I really, we're trying. <laughs> we're trying. So anyway, let us know on the Tahitian pearls, white gold or yellow gold for your class. But the rest is all just a really spectacular, spectacular pearl. And again, a great look and a great size and a really fun way to wear your pearls and get something a little different. So we, we will try. And you know what, James, I'm, I'm working real hard on designs and customizations and I'm, I'm doing that like nonstop, <laughs> like the other 21 hours of the day. So what I'll do is I will see if we ever get anything in that we can make something just a little bit. Yeah, I know she wants two to, I know, she wants two to 300, I know, and I've never had, in, and actually, in, in about my career, I've not had anything in Alexandra for that price, but I will keep a lookout, and as soon as I do, or can, or will, um, I'll give her a call so she doesn't miss it, okay? So, it sounds good. All right, so, yes, 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 yes. Let's do this. I also have a pendant, by the way, and we have coral earrings I mentioned. We do have a Tahitian pearl, and let me just show you the difference if you're kind of wondering Baroque versus pearl that's more customary. This is, again, a smooth pearl. This is when you get the perfectly round pearl, and you can see how there, there's the difference there, and that's a good size pearl, too, 
but 11 millimeters is huge, but look at the difference there. And um, you've got that really, again, statement style necklace and really, really rare. So they're only 888. And when I think about that, I know, you know, again, when you're at the wholesale trades and you look at some of these really spectacular pearls and you buy them by themselves, and then you've got to, you know, put them together and then have them hand strong. I mean, it, it would literally cost, you know, think about $100 a pearl and then how many pearls you have, probably 40 pearls in the necklace. And think about that would cost if you're even just kind of making it yourself. So a big value there. Does anybody want to see our eight carat diamond tennis bracelet? The largest by far that has ever been here on the show. It is here. So looking forward to that. I know we haven't kept too many diamond tennis bracelets in stock lately, but wow, look at that. Oh yeah, the big stones. This is the major piece here, and we are so excited to bring you a major value as well because it's 18 carat, it's 8 carats, it's a lot of, lot of good stuff going on that bracelet. So if you've been in the mood for a diamond tennis bracelet, but you want a little larger than, let's say, the 2 carat 60 I had on Monday or, you know, even the, uh, gosh, we even had, I think the largest we've had was the 5 carat. That was in yellow diamonds. Thank you on those, by the way. Congratulations. Let me show you the coral earrings really quickly before I get carried away on the tennis bracelet. I'm, I'm really <laughs> excited to be able to bring you such a really important style in a tennis bracelet, but I wanted to show you these. They're a really cool stiletto that instead of just being gold is finished with a piece of Mediterranean coral. And I actually have the white and the yellow gold here to show you of which there's only one pair of each once again. So much like the whole necklace situation we just saw with the Tahitian pearls. This is the same kind of deal three, five, four, eight. And for those of you that love the coral color, I'll tell you the coral's hot. Coral is hot. The red orange mixture of coral and this is obviously just one of each earring so you can see the color and how it plays with this gorgeous rare Mediterranean coral that we love. Of course, let's not forget there's a diamond bezel set at the top, which also makes it very, very important. So you've got the Mediterranean coral. You've got this longer length. I'll show you on the hand. We only have one of each. They are six by nine millimeter coral pear shapes. Those are natural, of course, and organic. So we just went from one organic stone to another, but you see a totally different look. But some of the world's rare stones, because of what they have to go through to be created, they're not just mined. They're not just created in the Earth's surface. They're not just mined out of the ground. They're actually created by living organisms. So here is what you have with our one and a little more than a quarter. I mean, really just a beautiful, beautiful look, more like one and three eighths in your length. And of course, something sleek with the bar of gold. Let's go back to our wheel and show you here. There's the bar of gold, which is sleek, but you get your sparkle at the top and you get your bam color at the base there. So it's looking so fabulous. And all we got to do right now is blow them out. We've got one pair of each that shouldn't take long, especially if I make them less than a thousand Dallas or maybe again with the hot weather. I don't know if it's hot where you are, but it's blazing hot where we are. I don't know if it's just the Cinco de Mayo thing. I see every, every, every birthday I can remember has been just blazing hot here for the last several years. So anyway, um, just true to form, like a 100 degree day here. So, you know, I, I feel like you do get in that kind of summertime mode. You start thinking about, yeah, that the tanks come out, the tank tops, not the tanks, like the, the tank tops, tanks, the tanks. <laughs> Tony, what? Tony, I saw you in your tank top today. The top was down. The sleeves were off, right? Did y'all see that? Making waves all through Baldwin Park. That's what all the honking was about, you heard. It was with, yeah, Tony with the top down. Anyway, um, not even $9.99, $4.99, $3.99, I tell you what, make them $288. Let's see who's out there. $288. <laughs> I'm going with the eights today. I don't know. I got a lot of crazy eight deals today with that eight carat bracelet and 18 karat gold and all these beautiful. We just did 888 Tahitian pearl necklaces and now we've got 288 for coral and welcome to Wednesday. You know, Wednesday getting you through. I think I, I do think it's the most boring day of the week, but I, I embrace that and I say we can make it a little more interesting. You know what I'm saying? We can make it Wednesday gets no love. It gets no love whatsoever right? Nothing. So we're going to get you a real bit of happiness on this Wednesday. Something to look forward to and uh, new jewelry wherever you look. That's what we got. So there's even a Russian Amantoy cut set. We've got a ring and a, a bracelet that'll work together and look beautiful together. So let me know if you'd like the earrings. That's one of each there. You got a really good look, beautiful length, a little bit of movement and summertime, right? Is the feel, even if it's not 100 degrees where you are, I think that when you get these earrings and put these on, you're going to feel like just, yeah, this is a little exciting something 
a little, little happy and springy and upbeat and bright in color and really looks good with everything. I mean, from a practicality standpoint, that's important, right? Because we want our jewelry to be worn and get everybody to see it. So let me know who's got yellow or white. It also looks great with our fire opals, of which I have the largest fire opal ever. And it's here, right? That's the ring. That's the big ring. So just a little heads up. I thought this sold the other day, but I guess we made another one. So this is really exciting. Oh, that's right. We did because everyone missed out. So we've got the big fire opal here if you want to see it. We've also got a huge markdown on a pot of Eva. I know everyone's waiting for the pink zircon pendant, right? That's coming up tonight. Looking forward to that. We've actually got a couple. So it's our first time ever having like what? Anything with a, a little tiny bit of a multiple in a pink zircon. So that should make a lot of people happy. Let me know on the coral earrings. They're fabulous. And again, kind of incorporates what's happening now with that long stiletto drop. Really, really well done. Let's get, should we get to our wheel? Is it too early? <laughs> I've got a wheel coming up. We have the big bracelet. Let me say this very quickly before we go, because those earrings are done, just gone. And then, of course, you've got a really cool opportunity to get Paraiba at a tiny price. So that's something that, you know, wait any longer, and we're going to have fights on the phones for, for a Paraiba of this price tag. So let's just get to it now. There's a beautiful, beautiful Paraiba tourmaline. Almost one carat, rare cut in a dome style band. Now, you know, with gold doing what it's doing, the domes, when you start like throwing in lots of gold and you finish the under gallery and you set diamonds within it, something crazy is going to happen to the price tag. It's just, yeah, it's crazy, all right, but in the exact opposite of what you'd expect. Pata Eva being one of the most expensive stones on the entire planet, you'd expect a really, really high price tag, right? It's not happening. And this is something I will tell you in 18 years. I've had very few Paraibas that have ever, ever reached this low a level. So I would just say, for those of you that say, I really would like a Paraiba, but spending even $3,000 is not in the cards. This is one you may want to take a really good look at and then jump on the phone lines because I can't imagine this lasting very long. It is a beautiful stone. It is a hot stone. And, and it also, if you don't want to have to forego clarity, you just don't want to see inclusions. That's tough to do with Paraibas, let's admit, but this stone, Tell me if you think this looks like an under one carat stone. Sometimes the magic happens where this just really does look a lot. Does that look like under one carat? Because come on now, this is a big ring. It's a wide style and look at the stone stretching diagonally. I tell you, this is a lucky opportunity. 3815, never in a million years would I have looked at that and thought under a carat. That is really impressive. It is a seven. 3805. It's a 77-point Paraiba. It's got the diamonds that are burnished into the sides of the ring. It's got a little, I got to polish it, I got to admit, um, but it's really a good looking stone and the way it actually stretches across and then you got the finishing. So 77 points is what it says. I'll go with it, but there's no doubt this looks bigger. And to prove that point, here's what it looks like on the hand. So you can see that because obviously on a wheel, it's hard to tell, right? But there you can really get an idea of how beautiful and bright and see the ripples of color that are running through that stone. And then you have the times. I love when diamonds are burnished. Sometimes we just leave it at that. This is where you're also getting the halo around the stone. Take a look at this. We're going to blow it out. This is one of truly this is one of the great pleasures we have is to bring you great rarities like this in the best solid gold VS diamonds and yet price it like is nothing. There's a 28 point diamond weight here all around just stone and burnished diamonds on the sides and I'm blowing it out. 28 points is the diamond weight. We're not going to make it 49.99. That is actually where it started on this show. Instead, a whole different deal. Madness is about to ensue, but I have one. So it will be whoever dials in first is going to own this ring. And I'm sorry, everyone else, I don't have anything else that's priced like it. And I know it's not about price. I, I never advocate to buy something just because it's cheap. Don't ever do that. Like, I want you to love it. I want you to be able to wear it. I want you to be able to collect it and all those kind of things. But this won't be damn right cheap. So if you like it, grab a line and we'll go ahead and just uh, pick up your call here and say yes, because $49.99, like I said, that will not be your price tag. I'm blowing it out right now for first call of situation. We'll make it $1,099 right now. $10.99 for a solid gold band of this size. 
I'm sorry, but that's not going to be possible in today's gold environment. You can't buy the gold alone. And this has one of the most precious gems in the world on top of that with VS diamonds all over the place. So that is a really cool ring. And for those of you that adore these bigger styles and these gold presents pieces and these really utmost specialty pieces we have, that one is gone already. We're going to see who's got it. And let's get ready for our wheel. Bottom of the hour is almost here. I'm going to throw in a wheel really quickly here because it's just that good. So let me know who's got this. And by the way, do you remember our diamonds by the yard? I have the coolest earrings, which are almost impossible to display in any way, shape, or form, but look at this. They are fabulous. They are new. They are fresh. Those are coming up today, and that is basically the Diamonds by the Yard concept, but in a threader earring. You guys know what threaders are, right? Where you've got that instant look of like a double design, where you've got the chain in the back. It looks like you have two earrings layered somehow, some way, but instead they're just really beautiful and comfortable. They stay right where they need to be because that great shepherd's hook design, we're gonna bring you those. And that is gonna be, ooh la la, so fabulous and fun. A little fancy there, and we got all three gold colors for you. So let me know who's got the Paraiba at 10.99. Oh, so there is one cornflower blue that's certified here. And um, we might as well do this early since um, we, we really gotta show you what's gonna be possible today. Because this would be any other day. We got an AIGS cert on a cornflower blue sapphire, and you will not believe the price tag. That's all I can say. You will not believe it, what we got going on on this sapphire. And again, a large presence of gold, like the last ring, which let us know who's got it. I think it's still here at the moment. We're still waiting to see who's got it officially. This is kind of wild. And with the certificate, and I know somebody just asked me the other day, but sapphires are supposed to be blue all the time, right? No, and that's the beauty. There's really unusual colors out there. And granted, they're not just everywhere. They don't exist just in any store. You gotta really go to a specialty or a design house or maybe just here at TV On. But there are all these other colors of sapphire that exist. There are other colors, but sometimes you just wanna go with the classic. And that becomes even in and of itself. When you want a blue, there's so many different options in the exact tone, color, and hue and saturation of blue. So what we're gonna show you now is really, it says cornflower. It's really the royal blues that we look for. This almost has that cashmere color. If you've ever been to a museum and you saw on display a cashmere sapphire with the plaque, you know, from cashmere, you know, there's some of the rarest stones in the world. Actually, when we bring you cashmeres, they're usually the pinks or the purples or the reds, which are cashmere rubies. But usually there's some semblance of a combination of those colors. This is so rare because this looks like the cashmere color we would see from that mine if it were in the blue color. This is a beautiful Sri Lankan stone, as you're gonna see, because it is certified. So you got all the details here. That cert's coming with it for free, by the way. And this is the ring that is gonna have everybody saying, how did they how did they do that on the prices? Take a look at this. It's our one and only. And I always love this mounting because it reminds me of the way so many gems are mined, where it almost looks like you've you've carved or chipped away at the gold and revealed diamonds, almost like a geode, if you're familiar with geodes, right? This is really beautiful. It's 8, 800 8254 as a matter of fact. So it's been here for a little bit. That changes tonight. That is really stunning, 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 stunning material. And you are getting a really fabulous, fabulous rare gem in the blue sapphire that is natural. It is a carat 06. It's got the AGS cert. It is also 73 points in VS diamonds that are put together in such a beautiful way. And all of this band is finished on the inside. So you've, oh, look at that, flowers on the inside? Sure thing, why not? This is the most royal blue. I've ever seen listed as a cornflower, but again, everyone's got their own. <laughs> Every gemologist has their own perspective on that. I will tell you the AIGS rather is a little different than the GIA. GIA is based here in the US. The AIGS, which we'll show you here, is actually based, um, they, most of their labs are in Sri Lanka, which is why they deal with a lot of sapphires. So here's the photograph of your stone. I wanted to show you over here. It is a heat treated stone as most sapphires are. It's a carat 06 and it gives you all the details and all the ins and outs of your stone. So that's gonna come with the gem and the ring and we're going to blow it out right now and if you want one of the highest end sapphires let's just see who's really paying attention and ready to do a little shopping but more importantly a lot of saving on this wednesday 33.99 is not going to be that's been here gosh the 800 number and and especially that that low of an 800 number implies it's been here for about two and a half years 
We got to take it all the way down. Cert included, blow it out right now. I'm going to make that $1,699 for one caller. And instead of being the simple solitaire, it's in the wide band style, which is so cool and different. And then you still see the color through, which I love because sometimes when you get these royal blues, right, they look a little too dark or too saturated and suddenly you're not getting the glow. This stone has the glow. So one caller. If it's Amanda or Tiffany, let me know because that obviously is going to go at $16.99. I mean, just cutting right to the chase there. Here's how wide that band itself is. So just to show you, that really is a stunning, slightly rounded band. It's not just flat, flat. It's got a nice little curve to it. It's got that almost like diamond reveal look. All of those VS diamonds, almost three quarters of a carat there. And then a royal blue. Come on, looking like that. Stunning. And we only have one, so yell it out. Whoever's got it, it's fabulous. And that is $1,699. Let's try getting that mounting for $1,699. That is an impossibility. And then you know what's coming up next. Bottom of the hour is here. We're going to bring you something fabulous in a wheel. Elite Eight number one of the show is coming your way. So looking forward to that. So any questions on that one, let me know. And then here we go. We're going to show you what's next in a very, very special Super Duper Elite Eight with some really fabulous ideas, including there will be Paraiba and there will be Sapphire and a lot of different pieces that are, are really, again, some of our favorites to show you, but all marked down. So let's get to it. And uh, $16.99 if you like this one. And then we're going to start actually with maybe the highest end opal that's left in our inventory at this point. It is, yeah, it's going on this wheel because it is elite, right? So we've got this really special opal. I can't wait to show it to you because I want to stay, when we're close up to it, I want to show you the opal so you can really see these colors because watch what this does. Very few times do an opal give you where really it's almost like a hologram where it goes from purely one color to another. I mean, sometimes it's, you know, there's different patterns within opals, right? Sometimes you get pin fire and, and things like that where it's little, think of little confetti or speckles of color. This is really where you get these beautiful, it's like two great neon lights of lines there at the top, and then it really got, does go really color to color here overall, almost from green to red to blue as it moves. So it's a really fascinating stone. Boy, as you wear this one, every time you look down at your ring, it's going to look a little different, which is so fabulous and fun. Also have something for the diamond lovers, whether you want pink diamonds or white diamonds. Look at this. We've got a white diamond collector's piece here. It's actually one of our few that has princess cuts all together. This is a actual, think of a quadrant, right? I mean, it's literally, truly set like so. It's got four princess cuts, which give you the look of one big princess cut, and then there are rounds around that. Also do have, we've got pink diamonds in a large white band here. If you want the, again, wider cigar band style that we've been seeing already tonight in our Sapphire and our Paraiba, you've got a natural fancy pink diamond here. There's the Paraiba, which is looking so, that, that just again, perfection in Paraiba right there. It's not the biggest stone in the world. It's not our four or five carat, but it's also not going to be $8,000. It's really stinking affordable. I have a triple ruby ring. This is the past, present, future design that really nobody can get enough of, right? It's such a classic and such a great way to wear a beautiful ruby, but it's a little showy too, because it's like showing off the fact you can match up rubies like this in the rounds doesn't happen all the time. It's really a tough stone to match, believe it or not. And then you know what that is. Nothing, nothing, nothing is as bright as that gem is with its dispersion, except for the fact it also changes color. So it's a phenomenon on top of that. Then we have the incredible emerald you're about to see here, and that's a beautiful roval. We always love this mounting. One of our statement mountings here with that European design, so much work, carving, details, cutouts, pave, mill grain. It is a stunner, no doubt about it. And then since we're in the uh, Corunda mood here, let's show you it's uh, the ruby counterpart here, the sapphire. That's a round sapphire in the bright, bright blue as well. Well, so again, maybe a, a mounting a little more simpler choice than the last one, but we've got that option for you. And then, okay, are we there? Yes. So here's what we've got. I've got a little bit of a moment here to get you all on the phone lines while we can show you one of our really just fantastic wheels that is going to be below out central. This is going to be our phenomena stone. We also have a phenomena stone there in the play of color. How about natural fancy diamonds? There's your pink. There's your rare Paraiba up here in the front. Then we've got the three stone ruby, the round sapphire. So if you like, you know, if you wish your sapphire could be a little blinging and be a little bright and be a little bit like a diamond, you know, because sapphires are not diamonds and they're not supposed to be and they never look like them. But this is where it's almost like your sapphire can kind of play like it's this bright, sparkly blue diamond because it's the round cutting. So when you add diamond cutting, 
to a sapphire. It can do miraculous things, which usually sapphires don't do, right? They're not usually known for a lot of glow. And then you add on top of that, this one's got sparkle to it. Sparkle, bright. I got an Elite Eight here for you. I got a blowout price. If there's anything you want, we've got one of a kinds that are gonna fly. And it's funny because we had every single one of these on the year before. Every single one you should be familiar with. The designer piece, by the way, is 18 karat gold. If you got your eye on the white diamonds, the princess cut white diamonds, that's 18 karat gold, as that line always is. 18 karat gold with BS diamonds, but princess cuts. We don't usually see princess cuts. Most of our diamonds are done in rounds. That's how most of our accents remain. To get princess cuts in a ring that are big and that's the centerpiece uh very special in 18 karat gold so keep that in mind because that one's got 60 points in diamonds just in and of itself if we have anybody thinking about anything on this wheel give me a call because i know <laughs> The ruby piece has been over $3,700. The color change, listen, there aren't many color change fiends left at all. We were the very first to debut them on television the world over back, gosh, about a year and a half ago. They're almost gone. So there are just very few opportunities left to get. And that's a four carat stone nearly. And then we've got the sapphire, the round sapphire, the stunning Paraiba, clean, bright, neon, the signature color. Don't wait on that Paraiba because there will be folks asking for that Paraiba in droves. And then we've got the black opal, an incredible black opal, which by the way, if you're already thinking about the black opal, let me just remind you that has over a carat of VS diamonds. So that mounting all by its lonesome should be a lot more than where I'm taking it. And then we've got the emerald and the pink diamond. Wow, <laughs> what a wheel, right? And all you gotta do is pick your favorite because the price tag is coming super ultra low on every single piece up there. All you gotta do is decide. If you can't decide, no problem to pick out two. You get two. Why not? No rules that say you can't take advantage of the values in a very big way. This would be the perfect wheel to do so. They're not 37 or 27 or even $1,700. They're not even going to be 1500 bucks. And we got some really high-end examples of what jewelry is all about. But usually it's tens of thousands of dollars. Let's be real, right? Instead of even 15 or 14 or 13 or 12 or $1,100, they're not. Take a look. We got to pick your favorites here and see who's on what. Which one do you love already? On the what? The pink pear shape? Of course, we will do that. Yes, they want to just say, what, what's going on with the pink diamond here? Nothing in pink diamond should be $11.99. You are correct. You are definitely correct. Let me just come in close. They just want to see me like take down that wheel, right? All that time setting it up, making it perfect. And look at this. You get four other rings with it. No, <laughs> that's just the mere finishing of the band. Okay. So yeah, just again, for sake of time here, we'll leave the other rings up there. Uh, but I want you to see there is a really, really special pink diamond center stone there. This is item number 4196, by the way. It is as it is rose gold and white gold together, but it's a wide, wide band. Pink diamond atop it, nine pointer, 40 points the rest of the way. So there's a close up look, Anthony, at that one. And then we'll bring them all in and show you what we got because everyone's going to choose a different piece here. Which one do you like, Adrienne? The opal I love. I kind of had a feeling you might be after the opal. I am so excited about that opal, especially considering it is a large 98 point stone with a carat 03 and VS diamonds since I'm number 2888. Blow them out! Not even 1099. We're making you the deal of a lifetime on whatever favorite you have up there. And this opal, it literally goes one color to another, to another. Look at those tanzanite blues and purples and then the reds and the greens kind of take each other's place. Isn't this fascinating? It's why it's a phenomenal stone, guys. They are the most fascinating stones. And then you get that really cool. It just ripples like waves of color that run over the stone. We're going to blow them out right now. Every single piece has got to go. Make them $999 while they last for our fantastic Elite Eight Part 1. There's 18 karat gold right there. That would be the Prince Princess Cut Quadrant. That opal is already spoken for. Let me try it on really quickly before we go. 2888 is the item number on the opal and a split shank too. And the pink diamond is gone. See those colors? I mean, look, every single aspect of the stone from side to side end to end, they're giving you color. So the pink diamond is gone. Congratulations. By the way, Anthony, that's finished on the inside. And so it's really, it's completely done. I'll try that one on for you as well. That's the pink diamond. 4196 is the item number there. Boy, these are must be really hot in here because none of these are fitting. <laughs> it is really hot in here. Um, so that's the pink diamond for Anthony's collar. Which one for you, Amanda? Question. Oh, no. Okay, Adrian, let us know if that opal comes back. Okay, <laughs> let us know if it comes back by any chance. We got a, we got a little wait list going for it. Yeah. 
That one's right now. Which one? Oh, the emerald. Congratulations. That one right now is a six. And I would say size up a half size on that one because it is so wide. So here we go. Here's the emerald on the hand. That one's gone too. That emerald is item number 4397 for you. It's a four by five in a roval. Yes, Jess. Diamond ring. You got it. That's 18 karat gold. Item number 4469 for you. And it's 18 karat gold. I'll try that one on next. So Tiffany's got the emerald. Here comes, oh, we got to move these around. So here comes the diamond ring. Watch how this looks like one big center stone. It looks, and that's the design. When you put these stones side by side, what's called an invisible setting. This really does look like you've got a really big solitaire and a princess cut. It's four princess cuts together. Then the rounds around that. Then the rounds down the shoulders. That's going to be 60 points. And remember, it's 18 karat white gold only on that one, Jess. So let me know if you'd like that and then we'll show you. Let's rearrange because we got kind of a yeah, a little imbalance on our wheel here. So let's bring them all in. Yes, that's a good question. Let me double check that one actually tapers a little bit. Let me see where it's at right now. Yeah, that one I would also size up a half size on half size on the Emerald too, because it does taper, but it's still pretty wide. Let me show you. It's still yeah, that's a pretty wide piece through the back. And you can see the sizing bar is only really the last, you know, really quarter of the ring here. It's three quarters of the way a design. Usually the design would stop right at the, you know, this, the midway point of the ring. This keeps going. So it's a great look there. Congratulations. All right, final, final call. Let me kind of walk you through what's left here because we have some really superstars that are still here, like that Paraiba. Remember, super clean, gorgeous Paraiba. The color is screaming. We also have that stunning blue sapphire. That's a round. You don't see a lot of brown, round blue sapphires. And therefore, it's giving you a lot of extra sparkle that sapphires just usually do not do. And speaking of, same thing here. Three round rubies, all out of Burma, all together, looking so fabulous. So, and then the color change fiend, which is also amazing. And do you realize that stone, all on its own, is nearly four carats in size? So, really important, very, very important to realize that that's fiend on its own. If, you know, back in the day when we brought these to you and it was like, you know, the biggest thing, right? And, and it's just, there's so few left. This is all on its own, needs to be more than what we're representing in that price at $9.99. So just really think about collecting that gem. It's super, super, super rare. It's it's a $3.95. It's got VS diamonds to go with it. It's yellow gold only, and it's fabulous. So anyway, blue sapphire, triple rubies. I like the triple ruby ring because that's, again, presence all across the hand, which you don't, you know, typically a ring is more just like concentrated towards the center core of the ring. This is really all across the way, which is so, so stunning. The way you get really diamond and rubies going all the way across and remember that's ruby um, the ruby is the July birthstone coming up and it's also the finest variety of ruby Burma is the absolute best it's the leader in quality of rubies worldwide there is no better quality in a ruby than Burma so you've got a very very special stone represented there congratulations let's give it a final 60 seconds and we'll roll yes who got your pink diamond hi Lori thank you so much Adrian the opal Dealey daily cool and we'll find out with tiffany you got the emerald as well and the white diamond rings verifying right now and check this out this is what i'm talking about with this ruby all of these stones so magnificent just completely across your finger that's the beauty and yes they're round so they're giving you their sparkle as well not something rubies are known to do and let me tell you when you get a ruby out of burma and you got three stones consistently matched and they're round cut that is impressive. So that's a ring I would really seriously think about at $9.99. Congratulations. And then we've got that Tanzanite the bridge coming up for you. Don't forget about that. So much more. And if you have requests, please sure and get them in because we can go scour the inventory, bring you out, whatever you're looking for. But I think it might be time, especially if you need a moment to think about this or if you want to actually better yet, go scout what's going on with a diamond tennis bracelet of this size. Let me tell you, it's not easy to find because not every retailer in the world is selling diamond tennis bracelets of this size. Yeah. Hi, Nancy. Thank you so much. Nancy got an emerald. Very good. So thank you so much. And it sounds like our rubies are going out as well. Thank you. Thank you. But what we're going to do is show you, do you realize TV on has been in existence now for, I don't know, four or five years. Let me say this very quickly because we have never seen a bracelet of this size. So that is, and you know, we brought you some really, I would say, what do you think? Some pretty good pieces, <laughs> you know, TV on kind of really synonymous with the best of the best in jewelry. I mean, we bring you a yellow dot and of course now the 
phone lines are going crazy for our lead eight. So I don't know why everyone waits, but again, if you have any questions, we'll help, help you out as best we can. But I really want to show you this bracelet because before anybody says, okay, eight carats, what's going on? I want to just remind you, this is something that's tough to find. I did the leg work today for you. If you are looking in this size of bracelet, because what's happening? The diamond tennis bracelet is really defined by diamonds all across the way. A style that will move and spin on your wrist with you. It's got great movement, but as a result, <laughs> to get something special that's really seen and noticed, you end up with some really big diamond weights. And with big diamond weights, the price goes crazy. So not everybody is sporting a diamond tennis bracelet of this size. This is eight carats plus. Not only that, it's in 18 carats solid gold. It is exactly seven inches because it took every last bit of the entire collection to make seven inches because collecting diamonds that are all I clean like this, that are white, white and I clean, it's really tough to do and still get you the value. Because think about it, diamonds are usually what, $12,000 a carat minimum? Times eight, that's a big number. And that's why a lot of people aren't sporting huge tennis bracelets. Remember, you can wear it every single day if you so choose. You can wear it every day. This is from 10 feet away, and look at how stunning this is. Do not wait. Do not wait because there's one, and one alone. It is item number 4462. And again, if you are certainly, like, I, I know with a bigger purchase, a lot of people are, are inclined to say, well, I'm going to go look. And if you find that other people are charging triple, quadruple, five times this price for half this diamond weight, and then you come back here, it's not gonna be here. I can tell you, we really don't bring you diamonds like this every day for the simple reason that they're not usually a value. It takes a lot to get you. I mean, a lot of people make the mistake of thinking, but diamonds are so everywhere, so why can't you bring us diamond hoops and diamond studs and diamond solitaires and diamond bracelets all the time? Well, it's because you guys also tune in here expecting something called value. You want a big value. You don't want to pay retail. You don't want to pay wholesale. And you don't want to pay when anybody's charging across the dial. You come here for the very best. And I'm not talking by 100 bucks. I'm talking thousands and thousands. In this case, we're going to save you tens of thousands of dollars off of wholesale. True story. So I want you to think about it. Give it a little bit of thought. I wouldn't be surprised if it goes right now. But this is just that kind of size, which somebody out there probably has been waiting for TV on to unveil. So let's show it to you. It's 8 carats 03. Wow. Is it 803 or 80? no, 802? 802. 802. Yes. Okay. She got them. She likes her diamond studs. Diane, thank you so much. She got yellow diamond studs and she got them today and she says they're stunning. Very nice to hear that. Thank you, Diane, for the call. We appreciate that. I wonder if she got the cushions or the heart shapes. That's what we've had lately, cushions and heart shapes that I'm remembering. Hmm. Uh, well, well done, Diane. Thank you. I'm just going to twirl it around, Tony, real quick. I, I, it doesn't sit right at a, <laughs> at a great angle to see the diamonds. And you'll really see it best when it's on the wrist here. This is item number 4462, and it is a uh, solid 18 karat white gold bracelet before you set these amazing diamonds. And they are all, like I said, now, now I know those of you that are going to say, but I want VS. If you do VS in this size diamond, it's going to get, it, it's going to be a matter of, do you want the bracelet or do you want a really nice home? That's, I mean, I'm, I'm just, let's be real here. So what we've done here is we have given you, and I'm not talking about like in the middle of nowhere, a nice home. I'm talking maybe like in a, in a, you know, in a stance, in a populated area, like, you know, really, truly guys, literally because the stones are so big. So what we've done is we know how you want quality, 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 nothing more, right? You want quality. So what these are, every single stone is eye clean. What does that mean? That means it doesn't appear any different really than a VS stone because unless you have a loop or a microscope on you and you're able to take the bracelet off and really look at each stone individually close up, you're not going to see the visual difference because eye clean means you don't see any inclusions with your naked eye. So it's still able to give you the sparkle. I would say this is the bracelet you're getting, right? Look at how white the stones are. I mean, we're really, we're, we're very unforgiving in the way we present things and that's on purpose because we want you to give it a scrutinizing look. So when you see this bracelet and you notice, like always, it's on a stark white background. 
And if there was any yellow or brown or any what we call body color to those stones, oh, you best believe you would see it plain as day, especially from this view. It is seven inches only. It is white gold only. It is a fabulous, fabulous 802. Let me try to pop it up to, so you can really see these stones. I think it's best on the wrist. You're going to get a really good idea of how important this is. But there is a value because it wouldn't be here if it wasn't a value. And I know you can spend $12,000 a carat. Truth is, that's for little tiny baby accent stones. We are dealing with an entirely different animal here in that they are huge stones. And at 12,000 a carat does not apply when you're starting to talk about non-accent material. This is not Melly material anymore, but let's still apply the $12,000 a carat to the 802 and you are just under $100,000. And then there's the 18 karat gold to contend with. I have one bracelet. I've got one great value. We're looking at $96,240 to the exact just for the diamonds alone if you take my very, very super conservative per carat price tag. So what we're doing now is going to take you to a new world. And that's the beauty of it. It's only for one collar. Let me put it on my wrist here so you can see this incredible size, which, yes, you already, I think the real telltale uh, indicator is seeing it from the distance you did, but look at that. That is also very, very important to see what exactly we're talking about. And yes, they go all the way through in that same huge diameter. There's one end of your closure. Here's the insert closure on the other end. And instead of having the figure eights, this is really, really a large bracelet with a huge gold weight. You can see how it's finished in the back. Look at that. No little empty, tinny, tiny baskets here. This has got a really, really good, solid, solid, solid. It's really like a fort of gold under every single diamond. And then the safety closure is going to be your fold under style, which is actually on this side here. So if you see it, it's open there. That's the little mechanism that then, once it is latched, this actually folds under and locks it. So what it, what it ends up doing is creating a really seamless look. You don't have these, you know, big figure eights on either side that are going to catch on everything and be like this, you know, really obvious, hey, look at me, there's your clasp, right? It's a little bit more seamless and a little bit more hidden when you've got the fold under style. So it's really spectacular. We have one in the world. Treat yourself to this bracelet because there are very few opportunities and moments where you can get diamonds of this size priced like I'm about to do. If anybody would like this tonight, it is for one collar pieces like this. We see literally, well, I could say once in every five years because that's now our track record here. I'm going on how long we've been here versus we've never had one. So here it is and a fantastic value at that when it's not even going to be. I mean, a sale price on diamonds would be what? 10% off? 10% off. So they take another $9,600 off and get it down to something like 86 or $8,700. Or 86, oh my gosh, we're dealing in numbers I can't even fathom anymore because we're not used to seeing five digits up here, right? $86,000. And remember, the tax you would pay just on, on a retail piece like this would be a good chunk of money as well, close to $10,000. So I love that we're going to take it so, so low for you so you don't have to pay anything like you would for diamonds. I mean, if you're a jeweler in the business, you might want to buy it and resell it. That's something you put in your store window and you go, hey, look at me. And you've got a piece that people know automatically the value of such tremendous diamonds. We're not going to do 96,000 or half of that. Can you imagine walking into a jewelry store and they say everything's half off? You'd really wonder what's up, right? Because jewelry just doesn't go half off, right? Doesn't. Despite the big markups it gets in retail, you don't see values like that or sales like that when it comes to precious metals and diamonds that are always on the rise. They're always on the incline of value, not decreasing. So when we do half off, and you think about $48,000 and you're going, okay, now we're talking. We're not sticking at 48 or 38 or 28 or even $18,000. This is what's so incredible about getting diamonds. When they come around, I, I, I just again, it doesn't happen often that we've got this level of diamond for you, but it is here tonight, ready for one caller, and it's not even going to be $15,000. If you want it, let me know. We've got one available. It's in the white gold only. It is a seven inch only. It is a fabulous value for anybody who knows diamonds and has wanted to own one of the biggest diamond tennis bracelets I've seen um, us do really and certainly by a long way. Take a look at it. It's not even going to be 15, 14 or 13 or 12, which right now 
Oh my goodness, these diamonds are so massive. Every single one of those could be a center stone in a ring. And instead, we have loaded them up seven total inches of diamonds. And it's not 12, and it's not 11, and it's not $10,000. I'm blowing it out right now. First caller can have it for $99.99, and that is it. We are making the biggest bracelet we've ever had. The most incredible value I've seen us do on gigantic diamonds. And it is for one caller. And we thought, you know what? It is time, especially with Mother's Day, just a couple days away. Can you imagine having this as your celebration piece, as your beautiful commemorative piece for Mom's Day 2020, right? A beautiful way to get something that I think you're going to wear every day. I hope you will. I certainly hope so. That would be the hope. That would be the wish. And you can. Eight carats plus. Think about it. Give it some thought it is $9,999, which is hard to believe when you get that kind of diamond weight. And um, what I'm going to do too is when I get it off the air, I'm going to count the stones. I want to get you the exact carat weight because they should be, um, they probably are going to be, I would guess around, I think they're going to be around 30, 40 points a piece. So it's really just, it's, it's absolutely stunning. So $99.99 if you'd like it. We never get to have pieces like this because again, it's not about the ability to bring it to you. It's about bringing it to you at a major value. That's the difference, right? I mean, again, I could bring pieces like that all day, every day if it's $96,000, but how many of you are gonna say, yes, that's great, let's do it. You know, that's a different category that we're really known for bringing you values like, like nowhere else. And that beats even wholesale. And we have certainly done that here. So give it some thought. Wanted to show it early so you can think about it. And if you need to, if you're not sure because you haven't been looking at eight carat diamond tennis bracelets, then take a look because I'm not saying go, you know, Trump to like go, go kind of like head out to a store. I'm saying you can just like go online and do those searches. Make sure you're comparing apples to apples because we got some really superstar eye clean white stones here. But again, take a look at what real, real, real diamonds go for. And when you get that kind of size, boy, does that price elevate quickly. So a great opportunity. And before we get to our top of the hour, I want to show you this is really just in line with diamond lovers who I know we've got your attention now. This is what I want to share with you in this threader style of Diamonds by the Yard. By far the most popular necklace style we've ever had. Just recently I brought you our first ever Diamonds by the Yard pieces and there were only four examples and they were all gone in about 30 seconds. What we've got here is a really beautiful dramatic earring, but at the same time, there's almost a light airy casualness about it. I get it, they're long. I will tell you, we've never had an earring of this length ever in our history at TV on. It is item number. 4476 and this is really really beautiful because it's not only that whole bezel set diamonds by the yard idea it's actually also a threader and what that means is and you can see there it's just about a three inch length really i mean just under it's like two and seven eighths of an inch here in its length but this is the threader style and this means, so you see this bar at the base of the back here. That's where you're actually going to put, that's where you begin to put your earring on. So you're going to have that bar. See how the bar is at the end of the chain. That's going to be where you put that bar through your ear piercing. And you're going to thread it all the way until it's happy. And when it gets happy, it's going to rest right on that, that kind of beautiful loop, right? It's like a shepherd's hook, but it's really like two shepherd's hooks, right? So then in the front, bezel set diamonds, four on each side. Yes, these are VS diamonds and you're actually getting a uh, 25 point diamond weight here. But again, kind of like the bracelet, individually more substantial sizes here and that you've got just the four on each side. So we've got um, a certain number in white and yellow and rose. So this is extremely limited, but it's a really beautiful drop earring that, oh my goodness, if your hair is up, if your hair is back, if you just put it in a quick ponytail, can you even imagine the look this gives you? But they are light as a feather. They are absolutely stunning because what you don't get to appreciate right now because they're on a card is the fact that the entire back of the earring, which is chain followed by that bar, is also going to be exposed because your ear is only going to be right about here, right? So all of this length of the chain and all of this length of the chain, it looks like you have two earrings on, like you've done that really cool look, but there's no complicated effort involved. There's nothing to worry about. I know this necklace has been extremely popular in the necklace style. Now we're bringing it to an earrings, which I got to tell you is fresh and fabulous. And I don't even know if designer is doing it yet. We're going to bring them to you now for less. And listen, I've got three min two minutes till the top of the hour and I've got a whole special top of the hour planned. So let me make this simple and easy. They're supposed to be $999. I'm going to do better. And this is the rose. I don't know why they didn't bother setting up the yellow or the or the white, but I'm going to show them to you, which is actually going to give you a much better look. 
at how these work because when I just, you know what, stay there, Tony. I'm just going to put the, uh, the white gold on here and this is going to give you a much better idea of how this looks when it's on the ear because now you're seeing that double drape. You're seeing the two chains, the basically the one chain in the front, the one in the back, the front. Let's stop them from moving here so, so quickly, but that's kind of, again, the beauty of the movement they're going to give you. And that's going to be, you can see the back length is going to be a little bit shorter. The front's going to have all those amazing diamonds. They're not $9.99, $8.99, $7.99 or $6.99. We got to get them out of here in one minute. And we have white gold or yellow gold or rose gold. I'm also going to show you the yellow gold in a moment as well. I think you get the idea and you know what I would do this is just maybe probably me <laughs> I think everyone at home is going to go oh yeah that's Lolo for you I would get three of them I would get one of each color and I would wear them up the ear I would wear them side by side by side and it would be probably the coolest look ever because it would look like you have chains of diamonds weaving throughout your ear piercings. Obviously that's a look if you've got more than one piercing, but that is in the naturally the, the higher up piercing would be a little bit shorter in length. So there's options. They're really, really cool style. We've got them for less than, you know what? Let's see who's out there. I'm going to show you the yellow gold, my left hand over here. I'm, I'm trying to get the yellow gold free from the bag and look at this. Here's the yellow gold option as well. Here's what they look like. I mean, tell ya, they are just so amazing and fresh and fabulous and fun, but you're getting really important diamonds as well. $6.99, $5.99, $4.99. I'm already half off and I'm thinking we take them a little further for you. Again, our most dramatic length earring we have ever had. And the only time we've seen this gorgeous bezel set chain look which is usually a necklace is now in a stiletto drop double earring. Blow them out. They're not even four. You know what? I got four people on the phone lines. Let's go even further. Let's get everybody who wants to even try it. And if you're going, that's outside my box. That's outside my comfort zone. Try them. I think because they're not huge and heavy and weighty. I think you may, even if you are not somebody who usually wears long earrings, I think you're going to fall in love with these. I really do. You know what I'm going to do, Tiffany? Let's go even lower. We're very busy on our phone lines, but they're not even $4.99, $4.89, $4.79. I would love for you to try these because earrings are having a moment. And the, like, the cooler the earring and the fresher it is, I know we love our classics, our studs, and our hoops, but I'll tell you, this look is super hot. To have it in fine jewelry where you're not even paying $4.79, $4.69, $4.59, $4.49. $4 no! We're going to blow them out right now, and I'll tell you what, we're really busy on the lines. Please bear with us. If you're waiting on hold, don't hang up. We've got, guys, you have to let me know white, yellow, or rose because we only have a certain number made up and ready to go, and that's all we'll ever have. Make them $439 a pair, and there it is again. This gorgeous drape, they are never going to move, by the way. This hoop is or the loop, I should say, is so long, that's going to be what stabilizes. It's not going to work its way out of your ear, but you're going to have, again, and like, again, look at this. If I just do that, you get an idea of how this is going to have the front and the back and that beautiful double effect. So you're getting two chains, one in the front, one in the back, beautiful way that it stays stationary on the ear, but is comfortable and lightweight. Here again is the white gold. Let me show you the white gold again. Let me show you the rose gold as well. They are so beautiful. If you can get a couple pairs, why not? Again, mom's day is around the corner. I say to the moms, treat yourself. I'm sorry. Okay, they're not, they're not graded for color, but they're near colorless. So that means anywhere, because D, E, and F is considered colorless, I'm going to say these are just G, H, I. But again, we saw it against the white background, and I didn't see any, any brown or yellow. So they're very, very, I mean, that's an unforgiving background. So I would say, yeah, near colorless plus, because when we, we can't just give it one blanket color because they're all a little different. You know, if you're actually grading every individual stone and we didn't have someone grade every individual stone. So we're talking about an average. Yeah. And then I can show it on the wrist again. And remember, it's also in white gold. So if they had any body color, you would see it. We're talking about the diamond bracelet. All right. Bear with us if you're waiting on hold. 439 a pair and operators. Um, please let me know what gold color you're getting because I only have a couple in each color. <laughs> so we may be sold out on some, which one, James? Uh, yellow. yellow, okay. Adrienne, I hate to bug you guys, but I, I have to keep track of these. We don't have them, we cannot make these. We literally cannot make these. These are, you know it took us years to bring you the Diamonds by the Yard necklaces because they're a very complicated, complex, labor intense style actually. So it really is important. We've got a white gold over there, yellow gold, you're getting one of each. All right, one white, yellow rose going out over there. Very, very limited with what's left, 439 a pair. And that is again, the threader style. So you have that chain that's gonna be down the back. That's gonna be like, again, beautifully done. That's why 
I'm showing you from the sides here because that chain in the back is going to show up. That's going to show up as well. So it, it's really, really beautiful. And a lot of this look is happening in the designer world, but a lot of times it's more complicated. Like you've got weird backings and they can be uncomfortable. I've worn them. I know this is just thread it through and then it'll hit and lay and sit right at that hoop and then it's done and it looks fabulous. This is like a compliment magnet. Yes, Tiffany, go ahead. Oh, wonderful. Did she? Oh, no way. She's been waiting on this. I love it. And thank you again, Sandy, for she was um, extremely, extremely thoughtful and generous. And she wrote a beautiful note and a beautiful card and a beautiful gift. So thank you, Sandy. Thank you, Sandy. So, so, so much love for you. Thank you. It was much appreciated. So $4.39 for the pair. Let us know if you'd like white, yellow, or rose gold for our final, final, final. We'll get to our official top of the hour. This actually kind of just, just kind of hung out and translated over into our top of the hour. But we've got, uh, you got it. Two going out over there. One white, one yellow. I like it. Thank you so much. They are cool. They are cool and they're lightweight. They're effortless, but they make a statement. Usually that's not how earrings work, right? We all know that the statement earrings are usually the ones you can't wait to rip off, right? They're just too heavy and they're pulling and they're tugging, but that's what you usually got to endure to get a statement earring. That's just not the case here. They're beautiful and light and airy and fabulous. So $4.39 a pair if you'd like one. And then again, that double look that you're going to get. These are so fabulous. Anyway, let us know if you'd like one. We're going to move on and don't forget about the bracelet. We'll show you one more time what that diamond bracelet looks like. Want you to be able to see that one one more time, especially if you just joined us for our top of the hour. Glad you're here on this Wednesday. We are live. Isn't it good to see some live TV? <laughs> so glad that we're with you tonight. And of course, so glad you're with us to be a part of this spectacular Wednesday show. And do not forget, we've got this amazing, amazing bracelet for $9,999. And yep, that is eight carats of magnificent diamonds. Every single one of them stunning eye clean stones. And I don't know about you, but I think that with the white gold and the white background on our wheel, I think that you would really, yeah, it would be very apparent if those were just so-so stones or good stones or mediocre stones, you would see uh, a little bit of body color to those diamonds, but that's the bracelet you're getting and it looks pretty fabulous right there. So a big shout out to whomever is getting that one tonight. It is fabulous and it will not last. And it's all 18 carats salad white gold as well. So for our top of the hour, I've got something special. And it is the most talked about stone. I have rarely seen a stone, even when we've headlined, and welcome to the show, by the way, if you're just joining us, it is TV on and Lauren Blair. Glad you're with us. Only two short hours left in this Wednesday night show, and it's going to fly because the values we have to show you tonight, two more wheels still to get to, big top of the hours now and next hour for you. Unbelievable values, and maybe even we'll just uh, do some auctions here as well to see what you guys think about pricing and see what you want to do. But I have to say, what we're going to show you now you may just hear these two words and want to start dialing because the way this stone, and I've been here uh, to present, I first debuted Blue Wing Block Detans and I here on this show uh, about a year and a half ago, debuted the Color Change Fiend to the world on this show. There have been, I would say, some pretty important debuts. When you think about what we've been able to bring you, what we've been able to bring you for a first and only look, this is something that is only recent in the last couple of months. I don't know if there's ever been a debut quite like it. The difference being, when we brought out the Sphines, it was like weeks and weeks and weeks, an entire show of Sphines and weeks and weeks of bringing you everything we had because it was a collection that debuted and it was like opening the floodgates. Same with Blooming Tanzanite. We're still bringing them to you. This is a little different where this is a new stone out of a new mine that is just so popular, but we can't keep up with the popularity. And that is because we're literally getting the stones one by one by one by one. So what makes this so important right here tonight with this pink zircon pendant is I've been begging for it. I've been begging for it, but we knew we couldn't just have one. So we had to wait until we had a couple of stones come in that were identical. And this is what we've been. I told you we've been working on something special in the pink zircons. Here it is four, four, five, eight to give you. I'm not talking about 30,000 people here. I'm not talking about 30 people. I'm talking about just a couple of you will be able to get in on this deal that is going to make this one of the most incredible values we've ever seen. And it has been a debut like no other because uh, like myself, we're all just losing our minds over the stone. It is special. It is like looking at some kind of magical, rich raspberry pink diamond. It is so gorgeous. It is so rich, but it's got the sparkle that zircons give us, which is courtesy of double refraction. So what I want to show you is 4458. 
I can't say enough about dialing in early because, you know, I, I don't know. I, I, everyone's happy to see the pink zircons, but then it's like always one ring and there it goes and it's gone and everybody's feeling left out who didn't get it. So this is the pendant and don't worry if you don't have a ring, we'll still have hopefully a ring here and there as, as time goes on and as, as we get another one here and there. But this is where you could start. You could start with an everyday wearable pendant. We made sure that it didn't have like eight carats and diamonds, so it's not you know, something that you can't wear every day. This is a piece that's a classic style. I think it's absolutely beautiful, but what it all is really important here is the stone. The stone is the headline. And the stone is what we can't get enough of. Literally, can't get enough of it. So take a look at this. It's our top of the hour. A little bit late, but look at how fabulous this is in that gorgeous pink. This one's really a bright pink too. You know, some have always had, we, we've noticed and pointed out to you that sometimes they give you a little bit of golden. Sometimes they give you a little peachy tone. Sometimes they give you a little bit more purples and blues. This is really that gorgeous, bright raspberry pink, 4458. And I know it sits so lovely there, but I do want to make sure you see the stone directly face up to watch it work its magic. Let me polish it one more time. See that? That's why we love it. The pink zircon doing what very few stones can do in this world and nobody's on the line yet. Is it because I said I had more than one? <laughs> and everyone's going, oh good, I can order it next month or maybe in 24 hours from now or maybe, maybe even at the end of the show. Let me tell you, with the popularity of the stone, I would not wait even five more seconds to get on the phone lines. This is really important and I don't have a bunch. I just have a couple. It is a two carat 84 minimum stone. So that's the one you see there is the smallest one you'll get. Some of you are going to get over three carats and over three quarters, uh, three and a quarter carats, et cetera, et cetera. That just really is about how, how quickly you dial in. The sooner you dial in, the bigger stone you'll get. But this is our first ever pink zircon pendant. And I couldn't be more proud to have it to you. And it's only $3,200. No, it's not. Uh, we got to do better than that because I got a couple and we got to make sure everybody who's wanted one can get one of these pieces in yellow gold or rose gold or white gold. We were, uh, we've been remarking already when we had rings that it really does look good in every gold color. So it's whatever's your favorite or whatever you, you envision as being the perfect look with this pink zircon. But these are rare. Remember, it's a new find out of Ceylon, which is normally the, uh, the hub for sapphires, right? Normally we go to Sri Lanka and expect to see the best in sapphires. Well, that's pretty good company, right? That's not a, not too shabby of a stone to be compared to, but they really are totally different right? The Zircon family is its own family of gems. It's known to bring. We've had blues and, and hyacinths and gorgeous yellows, but these pinks are few and far between, and the mine itself is not a pink Zircon mine, let me be clear. The reason why we're getting so few at a time is because the mine is producing mostly the browns, which we've seen before, the hyacinth Zircons. Do you like one? Would you like one? How, and what are they thinking? Who do you have there? She's, is it Jana? Janet. Okay, so Janet's ready and she's the only caller. She doesn't mind that it's sitting um, like on its bail like that, right? <laughs> I mean, it looks kind of different. And if you're wondering, wait, that doesn't look like a pendant. That's the bail. That's just flexible. That's the way it sits up. But it's going to be again, that beautiful, beautiful pop of color. Yes, your bail is done in diamonds as well. Here's the beautiful inside. I want to show you from a distance how this actually sits on the neckline in a north south orientation with the pave diamonds in the bail. That's what it looks like from afar. It's good size and I love this kind of little it's so pretty the way it's it's like the diamonds are almost like floating above the zircon themselves and then they taper up to the bail and it gets really attractive. I'll tell you, you can try it out right now. $3,200 is not going to do it. It's just not going to do it. This is truly one of the most fascinating stones. It's instantly become one of my favorites and I've been kind of stuck on two favorites for a long while now. It, this has overtaken my new favorite gemstone. I think you'll like it too. It is going to be nothing, nothing close to 32. I got to get a few more collars. We'll blow them out. We'll sell them out. And it's the only pink zircon pendant we've ever had. So instead of being 32 or 22 or even $1,200, which I think is fair, we're going to go ahead and blow it out. And if you'd like one of these very, very rare collectible stones, which is nowhere else, grab your phone and dial in for our new viewers as well. If you are just fascinated, like so many of our longtime collectors have been, just really, really kind of just enamored with the stone, 
I am too. I think it's really, really special and you're going to enjoy it. And any gold you want, not even 12, not even 999. Tell you what, let's make it really affordable and we'll go ahead and sell them out. And if you want to get more than one, you may. Like, you know, you know somebody who doesn't get TV on, but you know they love gems and they'd really appreciate seeing something bright and fresh and beautiful like this. Give them the opportunity right now. It is not even $9.99 or $8.99. Let's blow them out. And we've almost sold out right now. Get them out of here. $8.88 first callers. Good luck. And one gone, two gone, three gone, and four gone. So just like that, they're almost sold out. We'll give it 60 seconds and then we will go ahead and say bye-bye. And we'll make this ancient history. Thank you, Janet. Janet's got the first one over there. Amanda's got the second one over there. Jesus got the third one and I'll tell you that stone just does not let up. That is not uh, courtesy of sparkle filters or star filters or any funky things going on our cameras. That is just a stone double refraction. The beautiful round cutting that just makes it wild. So 888 if you'd like it. That's actually I think now also the most affordable pink zircon piece we've ever had. So that's cool too. And you're getting a 284 at minimum. This is the 284. Every other stone is bigger. And by the way, we do. And if, if you want a smaller stone, let me know. But we do generally just say whoever dials in first, the first order of this place, they get the biggest. And then the second order is the place they get the second largest and so on and so forth. So, you know, it does pay to be on the early side. You know, not like it's going to make a huge visual difference. None of them are going to be like 12 carats or anything. They're all within reason. They're all about the same millimeter size, but we're just giving you a minimum because each stone was a little bit different. And when we have the unique factor of having a little bit more in quantity, we want to just be really transparent about the fact that, you know, if you're to get a three and a quarter carat, um, that would be larger than this one. So just a little heads up there. Thank you so much. Another one gone. Tiffany, you've got one too. And Jessica's got one as well. So that's about it, guys. We will give it a final 30 and then we'll say bye-bye. Just love that color. There's something about the color, but when you pair up that color, with the richness of the dispersion, which is really there are very few stones that are able to do that. Most stones, including diamonds, are singly refractive stones. This one is not. So you double up the refraction. Refraction really plays a lot like brilliance and fire. So you're getting that here in a big, big way, and it's an outstanding value. It's one thing if it's $3,200, but it's certainly nowhere near $3,200 tonight. And we got calls coming in. I hope we have a pendant for everybody. That's my only hope here. That's my worry. Do we have one for everybody? That is the question. And we have a pink diamond. Oh, I have fun diamond earrings, by the way. I do fun diamond drop earrings tonight. Okay. Do you want the last one, James? All right. So it sounds like that one may be sold out. Check with your operators and see where they're at because the computer is more accurate than my count, perhaps. We just want to make sure every single one of those I counted is in. So that is your last chance on the pink zircon pendant. And then, well, 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 take a look. Hey, look at this. Ooh, ooh. I just wanted to show you my birthday present yesterday. What do you think? Nah, it's not. I didn't know. I didn't get any jewelry yesterday. No, but look at that. I did get Hello Kitty toilet paper. <laughs> True story. True story. Have you ever, did you know that Hello Kitty also has toilet paper? Did you know that? She, I mean, I knew, yeah, we know she does like lip gloss and tote bags and trinkets. She has her own line of toilet paper. She's bit well. She's just, you know, she's she's very philanthropic. She's meeting a demand. You know, she's here to help. She's here to help. <laughs> Whatever you need, Hello Kitty can provide. Um, so <laughs> take a look at what I have there. Does anyone want to see that? We've never had anything like this before. I can tell you this. It is a 958 diamond like, diamond like zircon. It is a zircon, guys. But let me put it this way I've had three carat diamonds and four carat diamonds here on this show. I'm probably not going to have a nine and a half carat diamond on the show. Now, I never say never, but this is where, let's show it up close, shall we? Because <laughs> this is just too cool. Oh my goodness, I so want this ring, no kidding. I mean, oh gosh, there's a little, hang on, there's a little thread, hold on. It looks like a red thread, that's probably good luck. Did I get it? No, I didn't. But I will tell you this, 
Who is looking at the thread and the prong when that stone is able to, what do you, what, what's up? Oh, sure. The Marquise Paraiba, is it still here? Yes, if it's still here, I can. Sure thing, I've got it right here for you. Who's this for? Hi, Martha. Flashy flash on the Paraiba? Yeah. All right. What does she think of the 9 carat 58 white zircon? Silvery white. Blue white. Take a look at this. Martha for you. Oh, I got it better cleaned up than I did the first time around, too. I just really, I put a little elbow grease into it, and I got it real polished, too. So now it's, now it's ready to get a home. Now it's polished properly. That was item number 3805, by the way. 77 point Paraiba. I'll tell you, I mean, I, I, you got to tell Martha, that looks a lot bigger than 77 points to me. It really does. Got 28 points inside diamonds. That was $1,099, by the way, if you want that one. And then we are going back to it. It wants to be seen. It's coming up. I mean, I should just buy this outright, but you know, I always have to give you guys first dibs on it. Uh, white zircon, a rarity. We just showed you a pink zircon and a pendant, which I think is sold out, but do check with your operators on that. And then we have this amazing, amazing Paraiba, which Martha's talking about. It was $10.99, by the way. Yeah. I'm sorry, can you flash now to tell people from the wheel? Oh, she's going back and forth between the two. I gotcha. Well, the Paraiba from the wheel is going to be 3349. And let me put them, you know, I'll tell you what, let's put them side by side. That probably will help, right? Totally different rings. The Paraiba is going to be much smaller in the oval, but very nice. And you're actually getting where you get a smaller Paraiba, you get more diamond weight. And then where you get a smaller diamond weight with a bigger pot of you get more gold weight. So it's kind of like wherever you prioritize, right? Do you want more diamonds? Do you want more paraiba? Do you want more gold? I mean, do you just want a, a very traditional classic style mounting or do you want a big wide band? That's gonna be really the, I think the determining factor there because the paraiba in that roval was also $9.99. So there is, a, there is a $100 difference between the two. This one is $10.99 and this one is $9.99. So Martha, let me know if you have any questions or if I can, but see what I mean? That, that just looks a lot bigger than a 77 pointer. It really does. Yeah. Anyway, uh, can can we show? She's gonna go with the class. Okay. So that's the um, and that's three three four nine. Amanda, that's gonna have sixty three points in diamonds. So Martha's gonna take that one. And then this one's still here for somebody. But I'm going back to this. <laughs> I'm telling you. And you know, I'm not here to like say anything about like CZs. Nothing wrong with it, you know. But. It is something to be said when you've got a stone that's natural, that's actually rare and exotic in its own right, that looks like that. That gives you the look of a blue white diamond. This is a cushion cut, it's slightly cushioned. So I, I know it's got, you know, you could call it an oval, you could call it a cushion, you'd really be right on because the corners are very, very, very soft. So it kind of is right, kind of just towing the line, thank you, of a cushion cut versus an oval. But it is uh, item number 4398. We've got one in the world. I want, I mean, I shouldn't, yeah. <laughs> I, I wouldn't mind having it. <laughs> I just love it. I mean, again, I see a lot of jewelry and it, it takes a lot for me to go, oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> just have that, that instant, you know, you know, the pulse quickens, the, the palms get a little clammy, you know, you know what's, yeah, you know what that means. Um, so 35 points in VS diamonds to go with it down the sides, which is just going to be among the three stones on each side there which are your VS diamonds. And uh, so six stones in total, they're mighty fine as well. And uh, we've got one. So if you like it too, come on in and uh, we'll fight for it. No, <laughs> we won't. No, we won't. We'll just have a civil discord about it. Um, let's go ahead and blow it out. <laughs> let's blow it out. I'm not going to make it $46.99. It's totally collectible as that price would imply. Instead, we're actually going to go a whole bunch lower if anybody's loving it. That is a really special way to get a natural stone, an exotic stone. We've seen zircons. Heck, we just had a pink zircon and a pendant. We've had blues and yellows and browns and, and, and all these different colors, but this is a blue white, which I said this the other day when we had our first uh, silver zircon in a long, long time. I had mentioned that um, that oftentimes don't forget that diamonds, when they're really, really fine, they almost have a blue, hint, uh, a blue hint or tinge to them. When diamonds are really, really white, sometimes they actually just appear as if they have a little blue undertone to them. So when you have that zircon, that's certainly, I think, doing that, right? And let me tell you, let me point out some differences, because right now the, the rock crystal quartz is having a very big moment in jewelry. And rock crystal quartz is beautiful. If you facet it well, it can be really beautiful. But there's a difference between other clear stones that are like a quartz that are obviously less valuable and less rare. 
And then when you get the zircon, because remember with the zircon, we were talking about this with the pink, it's got that double refraction going on, which is why it is so diamond-like, right? Because the double refraction is what's helping it look like a mega superstar diamond. So $46.99, no, let's blow it out. I, I just need one collar. I'm spending way too much time on it. it should, it'll be gone in moments. It's just a really fabulous, unusual, unique. I mean, here we have seen two. One was on Monday. Here's the other one. These are total collector's pieces. And, and really, again, it's just a zircon. I mean, call it what you will. If you want to call it a silver zircon, a white zircon, a clear zircon, a, a, a kind of blue zircon, really. Not like the Cambodian blues, but it's got that little light blue effect. Take a look at it. We're going to blow it out. I promise you, we're going to get this one home, and it's just a magnificent mounting. And I love that it is the kind of mounting that if you did have a 9.5 carat diamond, this is how you would set it, right? And it could still be stacked with your other rings and pave bands and things like that, but I'm blowing it out for one thousand six hundred ninety nine dollars i'll take three grand off just to make it easy because if somebody loves it half as much as i do i want to make it really doable on the price so there it is and yeah it would still look great with the I, I just think man oh man between that ring and this bracelet if i may let me show you the bracelet is not included but let me just tell you you want to look like uh how about how about five million bucks you know how the proverbial saying is look like a million bucks Ooh, I don't know if that's going to work on this. Like, just imagine, there's the bracelet. We have that bracelet for under $10,000. That's eight carats in diamonds. And then I've got the fabulous white zircon, which is nine and a half carats plus. And that is only $16.99. I mean, just wow, right? Just a wow set. I'm just saying, think about those two together. That might be all you need in life right there, jewelry-wise, you know food, air, water, those are all good too. But this is jewelry wise, all you need. Throw in a, a pet if you're me, like I think, yeah, I think that's a must. Yeah, your dog. <laughs> those are my necessities, right? But that is a set. Anyway, that's the white, it really does look like the most fabulous diamond. And because what I'm telling you about the double refraction, even let's say it's a faux diamond. Let's say it's plastic or crystal or what have you. They're not going to sparkle like that because those are meant to imitate diamonds. Once again, diamonds are only singly refractive. This is doubly refractive. So it's going to look better in a way. You've got double the refraction that diamonds are even capable of. All right, call me if you love it. So here's what's going on next. I have fawn diamond earrings that are drops. I have the most beautiful pink diamond ring. I'm going to show that to you next. We're going to go from a fabulous diamond lookalike in a rare, rare, rare exotic. And then we're going to go to pretty much one of the rarest colors in diamonds that exist, which is the pink. Item number here is 4249. Well, 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 this is what everybody's been wanting is the round pink diamond. And it's here. Finally, right? These are not easy. Cushion cuts, pear shaves, that's what you usually see. This, ooh, I'm loving this. This is going to be a lot of fun, y'all. We're really, really amped. And we are almost halfway through the show already, so uh, it's crunch time here. We've got a 10-point natural fancy. Please remember, pink diamonds are big in any single carat weight. I don't care what carat weight it is. They're all in, considered important. And 10 points is large, especially when you've got a round brilliant like this. It is a pink diamond that is all natural. Let me remind you of that. This is an all natural diamond. It is just, we don't, when we bring you yellows or browns or fawn diamonds or what have you, any color, they are natural. I'm talking about not just from the earth and then treated. I'm talking about natural in their color through and through. So you've got a 10 point pink. You've got 81 points inside diamonds. We went all out on this one. The first halo is going to be also pink diamonds, and then your outer halo is huge white diamonds with shoulder stones down either side. This is a very, very, very special look, and all basically all night tonight, we've been talking about the beauty and the, the rare nature of having round stones that sparkle. Look at the pink zircon. Why is it doing that again? The round cutting really makes a huge difference. Same here, to get a round pink diamond that is so, you know the deal with rounds whether it's tanzanite or sapphires, which we've already seen sapphires today. We've seen rubies today. We've seen all these stones that are rarely cut into the round in the round shape. And it's, it's really mesmerizing. The pink zircon, you see what happens there, right? This is where you're getting a 10 point natural fancy round pink diamond. And why is that rare? We always know that there's a premium on round stones because it's a fact that they had to waste rough to get there. They had to actually leave it willingly on the cutting room floor 
to actually get that round. So there should be and always is a premium on round stones like this. We are ready to get this home and I tell you right now first caller you can have it for $4,799. Take a look at this a round pink diamond with lots of side diamonds. Usually these mountings have maybe 50 or 60 points of accents. Not here. $47.99 for our natural fancy. It's so pink. It's almost lavender, right? My birthday sister who owns probably the most famous purple diamond. You know who it is, right? Gosh, I was thinking of her yesterday. I think a lot of us in the sports world were thinking of her yesterday. Vanessa Bryant's birthday is yesterday. She shares the same birthday I do. Yeah, she's just two years, two years off from me. And, and I got to tell you, and we as Tauruses, as Taurus women, we are very strong willed and I love her for that. But I got to tell you, she has a purple diamond, a really important purple diamond. And, and it was millions and millions and millions and millions of dollars before, before colored diamonds were even the rage they are now. Look at that stone though, and I've seen that stone in person. It's spectacular, but this reminds me a lot of it because there's that lavender type color to it. It's not just a light. You know what? I'm, I got nobody at 47. I tell you what, let me just try something. <laughs> let me just try. I'm going to go out on a limb. We're going to experiment. I'm going to go $2,000 to open. You know what? Let's go $1,500 to open. You know what? I want to see who's out there Wednesday. We got to we got to make sure Wednesday is wild. A thousand bucks to start. A thousand dollars. Nothing. It's like nothing for you know when you actually what are we doing? Taking away all the diamonds out of contention and talking about the gold. You still have the 10 point pinky purple round brilliant. You've got the 81 points on the sides. I'm going a thousand bucks to start with hundred dollar increments after that. Let's see who's out there and we could very, very possibly give you the opportunity of a lifetime to own a pink purple diamond tonight. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. What? And she ended up with the, the oval, right? Yeah. Flash it again. Okay. Okay. You got it. Who was it? Uh, Martha. That's right. Thank you, Martha. Uh Oh, James, what do you want to see? You got a request too? What's that? Oh, wait. Oh, oh good. She's calling going. Where's my ring? Okay. <laughs> right here. I just got word. There you go, Martha. There it is. That's Martha's. You can't call on that. That's for Martha. Well done on that one. Very well done. So James, have her take a look. She's going to see that on her screen. And then here we go. And let's recap the madness here. $1,000 to start. <laughs> well, this is interesting. No open yet. Okie dokie. No open, $1,000 to get it all started. And that is Pink Diamond. Does everyone have one already now? Did we get everybody? I mean, that's my mission in life at this point. Ever since we started bringing Pink Diamonds, which was only about a year ago, my mission has been to make sure that everybody who watches TV on has a chance at some point in time to get a Pink Diamond. And I know everyone's got different budgets and price ranges and different everything, right? Different just desires and jewelry. I tell you, not before have we ever seen an opportunity for a pink diamond of a significant size at $1,000 and I don't have the open. So just kind of that was my that was my little test. So it went awry. No open on this one. We'll give it 30 more seconds. Let's see if we got it and then we move. And my zircon is still here. I'm happy about that. I'm wearing it and I love it. I love it. I love it. I got to tell you that's a really cool stone. No open on this one though and it's a round brilliant. What everybody's been waiting for is the round pink diamond. So there it is looking so so good. By the way, if you do have our original Wonder Ring, any Wonder Ring, but if you have the OG Wonder Ring with the Kerato 3, who I'm just saying, I, you don't have to. This is really grand by itself, but my goodness, if you wanted to. I speak from experience, this ring would nestle absolutely perfectly. Perfectly. Look at how gorgeous this is. And I don't have a thousand bucks. All right, so I, I forfeit, I move on. I get it. I hear you loud and clear. The silence is deafening, but this is a really, really good ring. And I'm just imagining, ooh, can you imagine that wonder ring? That's my little wonder ring right there. Can you even imagine that? Maybe I should have tried it on like a year ago. Look at this. I mean, it's really a stunning ring. Okay, no open. All right. <laughs> so next up, I'm going to show you a demontoid ring. I've got a one of a kind demontoid here and a fabulous designer mounting 
This is really, really special because it's our, we, didn't we, we sold this the other day, but apparently it did not go through. So we get you a one last shot and the good news is it's come down in price. 4335 is the item number here. So let's go to another crazy rare stone. It's a Russian Damantoid 75 pointer with 18 karat gold. And how about this? Um, really cool mounting here with four huge baguettes. There's actually three of the same size and then as it gets closer to the pedestal with the stone, it's bigger. And then you have this pave on the sides. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Gorgeous Russian Montoid at a three quarter carat in a one carat diamond mounting and I'm blowing it out. We got one in the world. It's just as it is in the white gold, only 18 carat. Do you know this is not our own mounting? This is actually a mounting. You probably may recognize it if you follow some of the really high-end boutiques. This is a mounting they use a lot with diamonds. You know who. They're known for engagement rings. If you want to just spend like more than you can ever dream on a diamond engagement ring, that's where you go. Like if money is literally no object, that's where you go. And they do this mounting a lot for their one carat center stones and for their one carat and a half center stones, things like that. We've actually upped the ante here by giving you a Demontoid, which is far more rare than a white diamond. And we're going to blow it out right now. First caller, incredible stones. We're going to blow it out for $1,888, but that is one in the world. So that is going to be a major, major, major opportunity for somebody who wants a major Russian Demontoid because that is a huge size in the Demontoid world. They are much like fancy color diamonds. They are large in 10 points. They are large in 15 points. And look at that neon it is exhibiting there to give you all that color. And this, oh, look at the glow. Look at the glow. So the stone is actually perched up high in this six prong setting. But you see how it's still glowing far below the stone. I mean, that's just really amazing. It's kind of got its own light, if you will, you know? It's like traveling with its own lighting crew and it's all just internally in that stone. So here's what it looks like on a more simple solitaire, certainly high end because of those huge baguette diamonds, which we don't always see and uh, as accent certainly. And then you've got that pave on the side. So that's going to be both sides have a pave profile. You can see from that angle there, you got all that pave. So it really does look good from every single direction, but you could still, you could still make it a stack ring if you want to. It's got a straight enough edge to it where you could put a, a band next to it if you wanted to. You could put that pave wedding band you've got, or again, our fabulous wonder ring, the ultimate stack ring. Let me know who's got it. 1888 for a wild, and again, 18 karat gold mounting. So just in white, that's the only caveat. We can still size it for you, of course, but it's just in the white gold. So that's gone. Congratulations. Just make sure white gold's cool with them, Anthony, and then we will be off to the races. Now, I do have this coming up. I don't know. <laughs> Is this one I should show today or should we savey savey? Look at that 476 blue wing. I was thinking top of the hour. It's only about 25 minutes from right now. I don't know. We had to like look at some serious data to figure out out of all the bridge mountings we do, which one is the favorito. This is it. This because it's the big one. Yeah. I love the open. What? The open. On oh what? Huh? The pink diamond? Yeah. Oh gosh. They purposely do that, don't they? Who is it? Really? Is Carol just going, well, nobody else was, so if I just come in way after the fact, I'll probably be the only one. She's right. <laughs> she's she's seen this show before. Oh gosh, guys, do we bring back the pink diamond for Carol? I mean, I can't sell it. I, listen, if I could sell it to her outright, I'd do it, but that is a $4,800 ring, so I can't just sell it outright. I'll tell you what, we'll bring it back, okay? Oh, against all my better judgment, I know how this works. We're going to bring it back for Carol. Carol, your wish is my command. Let's bring it back. The pink diamond's coming back, and it's item number 4249, but this will be here at the top of the hour. Is that what everybody's on, the pink diamond? Oh, okay, so super, super delayed today? Yeah, you're on the pink diamond too? Okay, okay, so Carol, you have company. Item number is, I don't know, did I move too fast? I felt like I was on it forever. <laughs> All right, the good news is we're going to sell it. 4249, and we have the open to Carol. So she was first. So Tiffany, if you want to go 11, that would be the next minimum bid. You've got the open. Yes? Good. Good question. Let's figure that out. Does she know we do free sizing on everything? We have 11. Thank you, James. So everybody, what? Wow. I think our delay got longer. Is it just because it's really hot? <laughs> <laughs> I tend to move slower when it's really, really, really hot. Maybe just so hot out here, our fiber lines are not moving as quickly. Is that possible, Tony? <laughs> Does that seem technically sound to say that? The size right now, Carol, is a seven. It is a seven right at this moment. Now, you know we size anything and everything that we possibly can for you to the exact size you need. I don't care if you need like a, a weird size, like a seven and three quarters, just we'll do it. So we have $1,200 now. Thank you, two bidders. 
two bidders, James and Amanda, going back and forth here. And we're at 12, and we may have a new bidder that's come in, and that tanzanite will be coming off. I am not going to shy away from that perfection. We are going to bring you that blue wing in the bridge, the big bridge, coming up at the top of the hour. Yeah. Yeah, actually, I think it's so pink. If I just look at it, and I know we all learned this back in, like, kindergarten age, our colors, right? I actually think it looks more lavender than it does pink, which what that means is that's just a really, really saturated color because that's, right? Look at it. Let's come in even closer here. I mean, right? Do we, can we do this? Let's just, and let me make sure it's focused for you. There we go. I mean, I think it's pinky lavender. I see a lot of blues when I look at it, which blues would be, you know, what, what actually makes a lavender stone, right? Purple is a combination of colors. So in this case, if you had a little pink and a little blue, it would actually look lavender. And again, I've seen a very important uh, purple diamond. When they say purple, it's not purple like a tanzanite. It's more lavender color. It's like a lilac color. This has a lot of those pinky lilac tones to it. So I don't mean to crowd it, but I just wanted you to get a really good look at that very important stone. And I'll tell you what, Tiffany's thinking about it. James is verifying. Why don't we give it a final, final call? That way, are you guys so annoyed by my mic cord or is it just me? So annoyed. <laughs> the cord wants to come say hi. Uh, $1,200 we have, right? 13 we're verifying, but I want to make sure it's official. So we don't have to do it over again because we've already spent a little time on it. So now we get to go ahead and wrap it up. Oh, they're out. So it's down to these two. And those are the original two. Those are the only two. So what do you expect? You bring an auction back. That's usually what happens, right? Something really, really important is happening right now for you. We are going to give it two minutes. That means if you want to get in, you still have two minutes to just make the phone call. That way we know when we see on the phone lines that you're thinking about maybe bidding and then we close the bidding option when the clock hits zero and we see who our top bidder is. It sounds complicated, but it's not. It's really easy. So if you are brand new or you just are brand new to this auction, you got two minutes to jump in. We got $100 increments until we sell it. Good luck. Final, final call starts right now. Take a last look at this. Final call, yes. Did she get the demontoid? Wonderful. Where was she calling from? from the great state of Arizona, it sure is. Thank you, Michelle. We're gonna go down there when baseball starts, right, Anthony? That's the plan. I heard Pedro Martinez today talking about, I mean, right? Not spring training, no, like if they start the season, they'll have three little mini leagues in Arizona and Florida and I forgot the other place, but, <laughs> huh? Are they really? They're there? So we have a place to stay, good. No air conditioning in Arizona? Is that even allowed? Is that legal? Really? What? No air conditioning in Arizona. That, that, his grandparents. That's what he just told me. I don't believe him either, Tony. I don't believe him. That's, that's hardcore. Woo, man, oh, man. Because <laughs> Arizona's like Vegas. It gets to, like, spooky temps. Yeah. Yeah, like 122, things like that. Oh my gosh, they're, they're tough. Okay, I'll be airbnb -ing. You'll be staying with grandpa and grandma, okay? I'll be somewhere else. <laughs> Actually, I have relatives there too. I have relatives in Scottsdale, so I can, and they do have air, so I'll be with them. My favorite aunt and uncle. <laughs> okay, you guys, seriously, I said that once on the air. I said my favorite aunt and uncle, and it just so happened one of my other uncles was watching. You know, he never told me he ever watched. He was a closeted viewer, and he was watching. And then we're at a big family reunion like a year later, and he brings it up in front of everybody. And I was like, oh, mortified. I was mortified. <laughs> I was mortified. Not as mortified as my mom was, because it's her side of the family. But oh, my gosh. <laughs> Oh, yeah. See, the things you see on TV. All right, so we have 13. Yes or no, final call. Clock is almost out. This is why we don't bring back auctions after the fact. All right, 13, yes or no? You got it. Sold. Congratulations. That's out of here. Well, okay, I still, I still have the white zircon. I'm, I'm trying to regroup here. Regroup. I still have the white zircon for you, the silvery white blue zircon, and then that's gone. Thank you on the pink diamond. That was fun, right? Just lost a bunch of money. It's all right. Uh, it happens on auctions. And by the way, that tanzanite, if you are at all really seriously thinking about that tanzanite, top of the hour, it's only 17 minutes away, you're going to see that gigantic blue wing block D tanzanite is so good. So that's on the way as well. Let's get to our, um, should we get to another wheel? We've got a great Elite 8 wheel for you before we go. Plus, I have fawn diamond drop earrings as well. 
Fawn Diamond drop earrings, they're the big ones too. A carat total in Fawn Diamond. So really quickly, before we do, and speaking of, there's actually a diamond ring in this next wheel that'll go with beautifully the fun diamond earrings that are coming up later. So that's going to be where we start. And this is actually a really big stone. It's actually one carat VS. This one's more champagne and I'll show you the difference because this will also be a great little lesson in fun versus champagne diamonds. And then you have, there are going to be a few other pieces hanging out together. Ooh, a putty, even a bridge. I love this one so much. It's our part two. Elite Eight Wheel of the show tonight. It's our final. And then I have, oh, well, this should probably be, <laughs> we should probably take that away. There's a purple, I only say that because what just happened with that last auction, not good. So we do have that one though. That's a purple diamond in a, a pear shape, heart shape combination. It's actually really a heart shape on that one. Here's, ooh, the designer, designer blue sapphire. There's the emerald out of Colombia. This is fun. Diamond ring baguettes and rounds stacked and then i have well 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 this is the it looks like a bridge but the diamonds don't exactly run all the way underneath the stone but close yes no oh no 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 i don't want to sell that one do you want to see on the hand or up close or what what are they thinking anthony this one no my baby <laughs> i know james like she's whining again She's whining again. <laughs> it is so beautiful. Anthony, that's the white silver blue zircon. It seriously is. Every light that it's in produces a slightly different color. That's the 9 carat 58, by the way, that I keep wearing that I think looks like a big old fat diamond. I love it. So next up, we've got a ruby coming up on this wheel, and that'll do it, guys. Two, four, six, eight. Who do we appreciate the Elite Eight wheel every time? I mean, this is just a really special value coming your way. So that if there is something that popped up here that you're going, ooh, I like, I like you, I like you, then that is why you call in before somebody else takes, no, $16.99. $16.99, yeah. Did you miss it? He's like, no, you just blinded me with it so I couldn't see the graphics. I mean, that'll happen on that white zircon. It'll blind you. So we have our one carat champagne is where it all started. This is our champagne. Oh, and I did want to show you just for future reference here, just because I know I get the question every day, what is a fawn diamond? Let me show you the difference between a fawn diamond and a champagne diamond because the champagne is up there. They go well together, but this is the earring that's coming up later and see the difference there. The fawn diamond, it's a lighter, 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 like a true champagne with pinks. Mm -hmm. Here's the other one. So I just want, you know, just as a little lesson in fawn diamonds, and because sometimes I think it really, really helps to see them side by side to do the comparison. So those earrings are coming up, but see the difference in the color. And like I always say, those fawn diamonds give you a lot of sparkle. So that's coming up later, I promise. But I just wanted to show you this wheel here and let's get these all at home, shall we? We've got about 14 minutes till that tanzanite arrives and we still have our eight carat diamond tennis bracelet and we have our lead eight out. So it's really exciting because of course, what do we get to do is we get to make everything on the wheel Super crazy duper affordable, and that's what we love. Crazy affordable, high-end pieces, beautiful stunners, purple diamond, yellow diamond. I mean, it's all here, right? There's even a one carat champagne diamond. So this is obviously a diamond intense wheel when you got three options here. And then it's not just that, but it's the diamonds that run underneath all the other colored stones, like the Paraibas and the Emerald and the Ruby and the Sapphire. We've got really the classics. I mean, this is, this is really the classic wheel with the fancy diamond wheel all together in really spectacular mountings. And it's my job to make sure that we get you what you love off this wheel. So I can't, I can't get the standard prices on these. $67.99 is the champagne diamond. So think about where that started. Cause again, I got part two here going on. So this even just jumps up in elite quality even more so. That's a one carat VS champagne diamond that is all natural, one carat. So that's why that one's $66.99, but here are all the prices. I got the Paraiba for $52.99, the Baguette Ring, $51.99, the Pink Diamond, which was really more purple in that heart shape, $71.99 on that one. And then you've got the Ruby, $48.99. That's probably the cheapest we've seen. $65.99 on the Yellow Diamond, $55.99 on the Blue Sapphire, which is that cool ring. And then you've got $51.99 on the Colombian Emerald. That is going to be where it all divvies out. We can recap those prices if you missed them and you're going, wait a minute, what was that price on mine? We'll go through them again. As you ask about them, do call because that's when we give you the carrot weights and tell you all about them and then you get to really know your jewelry. But what's going to be really sensational, here's the price, no doubt. Take a look at this. Not 51. No, they're not. I think the lowest price was what, 48? 
Yeah, so it, it doesn't matter. <laughs> You're going to save a bunch no matter what. That much I can promise you. It's just, again, going bonkers on the price tag to make sure they disappear. And if there is something you love on this wheel, and again, so many important diamonds from the one carat to the gorgeous yellow cushion cut, which the yellow diamond itself is a half carat stone with the pseudo bridge. And then we got, that is purple. That is all out purple diamond on that one. That one's going to be a 19 pointer on a heart shaped purple diamond. We're going to blow them all out. There's even a Paraiba. That's a true bridge, by the way, where the diamonds run all the way, two rows underneath your Paraiba. Anything on this wheel you'd like? 48, 38, 28. I'm running low on time in this hour. So this wheel has got to go in fast. And I'm at $28.99 already. We saved you a cool $2,000 plus plus because remember, $48 was, I think, the lowest price we saw up there. So that means there's a lot to be saved on a lot of these items beyond just two grand. And I'm not stopping at $28.99 either. They're not going to be even $2,000. Purple diamond, yellow diamond, and champagne diamond. Ruby, sapphire, and emerald. And then all white diamonds and then the world's rarest color, Paraiba. So you got it all. This is a good Elite Eight. And they're not 19, 18, 17. They're going even lower. This is our lowest price. And by the way, these wheels are here for a purpose. When you see something on this wheel, they are the lowest price possible. This is really why these wheels are so popular and why it's a time to shop 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 what you love because the prices can't go any lower than even this $1,799. That's not it. We're not done. I'm going to make it $1,777 while they, you know, I only have two callers so far. Let's do something different. My job is to make sure they sell out because that's the whole point. Putting them on a wheel like this, we want to try and save some air time by not showing them one by one by one, but giving you a value you can love. They're not even going to be $1,777. Come on in. That diamond ring, 18 karat gold, by the way, it's got a carat 20. A carat 20 of VS baguettes and rounds. And nothing is 17 or 16.99 or 1599. And that ruby is huge. Somebody already asked about the ruby. We got a carat 09 Burma in a classic double halo ruby. Don't wait on these phone lines. We got one of everything. One, like, do you think I have a whole, like, pocket stash of those? Purple diamond heart shapes. Are you kidding? Beautiful values. What about that super glowy neon Paraiba? How about a one carat natural fancy champagne diamond? One of the hottest colors in diamonds worldwide. Yeah. The purple diamond already gone. Hold on. We're going to go even lower because here's the thing. I love that they love it. 3224 is your item number, Tiffany. But you know what? I still need five more callers. If we're going to get this wheel gone, and we already have somebody talking about the one carat 20 diamond ring, the purple diamond is spoken for already, the emerald is being verified as well. We need to get a few more callers. I'm going to do everything I can here. And this is where I would not wait. You've seen these pieces on the air for the most part, right? Beautiful, exceptional ideas. Do call if you want to know how much you're saving. I'll be happy to recap those original prices where they should have been. They're not even going to be $15.99. We're the leader in value anyways. So when the leader in value worldwide for jewelry start to start piling on jewelry on a wheel and says we're blowing them all out at under cost, that's something to pay attention to. That's something to really go wild for and make sure you're on the phone lines because they're not even going to be $1,599. I'm blowing them all out. Take whatever you love. If you can't decide, get a couple. I mean, really, truly, you still, despite we're going so low on this price, you still get a money back guarantee on everything. Keep that in mind, too. So huge values take a look at our wheel they're not gonna be 15.99 we're making sure everything goes everything has got which one do you like the emerald and the Paraiba, you got it. So the emerald is item number. They're ready to go. They're sure ready. The Paraiba is 4011. The emerald is 4391. Both one of a kind. All right. Oh, maybe we don't need to lower the price anymore. Oh, I will. First callers, blow them out. $1,499. Yes, which one? Yellow diamond. yellow diamond for James. That yellow diamond is item number 4238. Yeah. Let me get it for you. That ring size, and it is finished on the inside, Tiffany. And the ring size right now on the purple diamond heart shape is a size six right now. Let me try it on for you before it goes. Which one for you, Adrian? Champagne. It's a one carat. It's pretty awesome. That's going to be item number. Oh, here you go. 2401. Two oh, thank you so much. Here's the, um, there's the purple diamond on the hand real quick. I just want to show that to you. That's the purple diamond that's already gone, right? Yes, it is. It is. 
I'm gonna have to transmit you guys. Even my ring size is not fitting right now. The emerald, let me try it on real quick for you, Amanda, before we go. The emerald is going to be, and I think you have the odd number, right? The, yeah, you got it. So that's going to be $43.91. That is one only. So you've got this one, right? All right, Amanda's got the emerald. Which one? Champagne. Adrian, did you get the champagne already? Okay, so the champagne, let me see what the item number is, James. That is going to be 2401, James. Yeah, for Adrian or James, whoever wants it. White, yellow, rose. I'm going to try that on very quickly. Oh, my. One carat. That's a one carat. That's without the halo. The halo is going to give you 30 points. So, James, total, it's a carat 30 in diamonds there. And the champagne is even graded as a VS. What the heck? We never see that. That's actually graded as a VS stone. And then let me try on the pot of Eva for Amanda as well. 4011. Anthony, which one for you? Champagne. Okay. Four, two, or no, 2401. White, yellow, rose on the champagne, by the way. And Amanda, this was your pot of Eva in the bridge. I just want to show it. I know you got it already, I believe. I just want to show that tea on the hand so you can see what that's all about. The sham or the um the actual pot of Eva is so stunning. Thank you so much. We'll go back to our wheel. We're ready. Back to the wheel. We'll go and take a look at what we have remaining and verifying. And we'll try to zoom in a little bit here as well. That blue sapphire is really unusual style, but really interesting and great to wear on, I, I think, even a pinky ring. I think with the point that it naturally has, the yellow diamond's amazing too. That's a half carat natural fancy yellow diamond. So a really good one there in that one carat champagne. Who does that? The champagne is graded as a VS stone. Okay. So never mind, our emerald is still here. Okay, hold on. Let's bring the emerald back. The emerald is here. The emerald is here. The emerald is here. So let's see who's got the champagne. I think that champagne is going out the door. And look at that bright, super clean emerald stone. That is a 73 pointer with 73 points in VS Diamonds as well. So congratulations. Go ahead and get on the phone lines. We've got two minutes left at this wheel. This is a 120 diamond ring in 18 karat gold so just think about what's going on i got to try this on because i don't think you can appreciate fully the design here and the technique of what makes this so unusual until you see it on the hand and see that it's really this beautiful stack each row has or i should say column has a baguette and round that are stacked together and then the entire ring is lined top and bottom with round brilliant diamonds as well it's beautiful two minutes Those fawn diamond earrings will be coming up. Yes, they are. We have a museum must go wheel as well. We have the huge Tanzanite in the bridge mounting that I flashed and previewed for you. Can't wait to show you that. That is really something. Yeah. Yes, I'd be happy to. That is item number uh, 4238. And this is a look-alike bridge. And what I mean by that is the diamonds do halt right at the midpoint, but it looks, there's two different levels in which they're set. So the middle row, the center row is actually recessed. So it does kind of give you that whole bridge motif and that bridge look. Let's take a look at it on the hand here. And that's actually, oh good, James, that's the one I'm trying on now. You and Amanda are talking about the yellow diamond, which is our half carat cushion cut yellow. He has a million and a half rings. Oh my, who is it? Hi, Greg. What's the item, item number? 4238. 4238, by the way, it has 73 on the sides. So let's total this up here. You got one carat 23 for 14.99. And that's a huge half carat yellow diamond that is a Santa stone alone. Half carat, square cushion, gorgeous yellow. So I think the cushion, I think our champagne is gone. So let me move the yellow as we're verifying on the yellow. Amanda, let me know if you've got it or if James has got it. That is such a cool ring. So let me recap that ring that's now in the center of the wheel. That is a one carat 20 total weight, total weight. How impressive is that? You guys are loving the diamonds off this wheel. The purple diamond gone. Sounds like the champagne has been spoken for. Well, of course, a one carat VS champagne diamond. The yellow diamond being verified right now. And we'll give it a final, final minute. Take us to our top of the hour here and show you what else we've got. They didn't get the silver zircon, did they, Anthony? The silver zircon? Still here, right? Good. Yeah. Yeah, let's try it on again. Sure enough, watch this. It is 73 on the sides, Amanda. I don't know if they, they heard that. 73 points just in white diamonds. Your middle stone, your center stone is a half carat individually. So that is a carat 23 
in diamonds for $1,499. And of course, that stone, the Santa stone, should be more than $1,499 alone, as it is by itself. So why on earth we're doing that? Doesn't make a lot of sense. But again, it's a blowout wheel. It's not supposed to make sense. It's supposed to just get every single piece out the door right now so that we can move some jewelry and give you guys the value of a lifetime. That's the point. So there you have it, $1,499, 14 seconds remaining. And then it'll take us pretty close to our top of the hour, <laughs> pretty close. Questions on that wheel, I would really, I know the wheels tend to, as soon as we take them down, the phone lines light up. So I'm just gonna ask that you dial in now. If you have any questions on this wheel, while well, we still have them here, up close and personal, to show them to you, to give you a great look, to give you all the questions answered you need. Really, really important opportunity there at 1499, yes. Oh, sure, what do they need? Okay, well, I do have to, if they want a little higher end, I have it. If they want lower end, I have it, meaning cheaper or more expensive, I have them. Okay, let me flash this for them. Yes. Well, I said it's, it's let me zoom in on it. This is going to be a lot easier to explain. Let me show you this. It is kind of like a bridge, the only exception being that the diamonds don't run underneath the yellow diamond. Do you see how there's a basket? Right there, I'm just going to stop it. Do you see if there's a basket? Normally in our bridge, the middle rows go under. This one, it doesn't. But do you see how it gives you the look of a bridge because they're recessed to the other two rows? So it looks all day like a bridge. They tend to want to run underneath, but it's a basket instead. That's all I'm saying. It looks like a bridge. It's just not a literal bridge where the diamonds run underneath the yellow diamond. They just stop. They stop at the midsection of the ring. Does that make sense? Okay, <laughs> so I would highly recommend the yellow diamond. And then let me show this to, before we get to our official top of the hour, yeah. I'm going to, yeah. Amanda just had a quick question on this one. I'm gonna show you this. Who's your caller there? I have a uh, 4392 item number here that's gonna be an emerald that is really gorgeous. And I can do something special here since we're running up to the top of the hour here. Let me make this really simple and easy. And Kelly? Does Kelly like this idea? It's kind of classic, you know? It's an emerald cut that's in, huh? Yeah, this one's gonna be a little bit less money just because I think that's what she was looking for, so I'm gonna go ahead and just make it so. <laughs> and it's 81 points in the Colombian emerald. That is what I want you to see about the emerald. 81 points, 30 points in VS diamonds. I'll do a quick blowout. And it's supposed to be $2,499, but I am aware that she, I think, wanted to see one option that was a little less than 15. So what I will do is this. We're gonna do a quick blowout. And I can still put them side by side, Tiffany, if she wants to compare them. But this is going to be more affordable just because I, I think she was going for that. Let's blow this out real quick. I'll make it nine, nine, nine if you want to steal the emerald real quick before we go. Yeah. This one or the wheel ring? Sure, that pave, you got it. So the pave, and just so you know, if you need the item number on that uh, emerald from the wheel, that was going to be item number 439, 4391. So Tiffany, this is 4391, that's 1499. That's gonna be a little bit larger emerald because that's a, actually, it's funny. That's actually a smaller emerald, carat weight wise. That's a 73 pointer with 73 points in diamonds. The other one is an 81 pointer. So interestingly enough, it, it, well, let's just compare them side by side. Look at the difference. I mean, there's very, they're pretty similar. As far as look of size, again, there's a, just a slight carat weight difference here. But uh, obviously, there's a, a difference in the cut. And I would probably think that, you know, you're going to have a preference whether you want the emerald cut or the oval. Those would be, you know, that's going to be, I think, a big determining factor here. So we'll go back to our $9.99 option, which is uh, just, you know, just seeing it here for the first time at $9.99. And then you can still get the oval if you'd like to. You want to see them both? This one. You got it. This one on the hand looks like this. So the difference being no diamonds down the sides. It's just a halo design around your emerald cut. I'll tell you, that stone, not, no emerald for $9.99 should be looking like that. That's an emerald that should be $16,000 per carat. So yeah, figure 14 grand for the stone. That is, you can't stop the glow. Super clean it for $999. We're getting you a Supreme Colombian Emerald Maze Burstone for $999. And it's got 30 points in diamonds around it. White, yellow, or rose gold, whatever you want in that ring. So that's an option for you. 
Certainly the most affordable emerald that's here. That is by far, for sure, the most affordable option in emerald I have in a ring. No doubt. Don't, we, don't forget, we also had earrings to start the show, which are here for 888. So if you want earrings, we got two gorgeous stones matched up for you in earring studs and just made the wheel worse. So let's go ahead and get to our top of the hour and we will talk about what's next. And, and um, Tiffany, did we answer the questions there? Or would you still like to see them together side by side on the hand or up close? Let me know. I know it's a, it is a $500 difference. This one's $9.99, the oval's $14.99. It really comes down to diamond weight, being 30 points versus uh, 73 points over here. So it, it is a lot about the diamond weight here. $9.99 though for the left side, $14.99 from our wheel there on the right side. So our top of the hour, I know is coming. We got our big tanzanite that I previewed for you, getting you a little idea of what's coming up for our top of the hour. And of course, if you have questions on those emeralds or anything else off that wheel, our operators are still really busy taking your calls on our Elite Eight Part Two. And this helps, I think, to see a little bit. They're both super clean stones, yeah. Yeah. A what? I don't have a men's wheel tonight. I don't have a men's. We've just done a little light on men's jewelry right at this moment. Um, we've just been discounting them so much. We've sold almost every, huh? I do actually have, I have one. Now I do have something in a fawn diamond, Greg. That was Greg, right? Let me just pop this in for a look here. I do have, a, hmm? Oh, perfect. Well, let me show him what I do have. I just don't have enough for a wheel tonight, but I do have a great <laughs> men's ring here. So Greg, check this out, and then we will get to our top of the hour here. Our Tanzanite is on the way, but take a look at this one. I'm number 4250, Greg, and let me know what you think of this. That is a series, I'll tell you, out of all the men's rings we've ever done, very rarely have we seen a carat and a half diamond in a men's ring, and this is a carat and a half natural fawn diamond. It's really a light champagne with just a subtle amount of pink, but this one in the yellow gold is really giving off a lot of the champagne colors here. Really spectacular the way this is a quilted style mounting, very large intense diamonds to go with it. And that is, oh boy, we can discount it. We can discount it. So Greg, let me know what you think of this one. The diamond wear along the sides is 48 points. And then Tiffany will let me know which emerald she ended up choosing. Kelly got an emerald. I think Kelly got some Kelly green emerald there. Very well done there. And the Pata Iba in the bridge, I think it's still here. You can check with your operators there on the Pata Iba in the bridge and see if that's still hanging out for you. Congratulations. So Greg, tell me if you like this one. And James, I thought you were talking to Greg, but then he popped up over. Maybe it's a different, maybe. Oh, huh? Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. So this one, tell you what, it's a pretty hefty piece here, but it is a blowout price. It is a blowout. You think you might like this one? It's the best one we got. Uh-oh. Best one we got. <laughs> oh, man. Hey, which emerald did you get? Good, 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 good. Thank you so much. All right, so we have a care and a half with 48, meaning it's, um, yeah. What? Which one? Purple wide band. Oh, the pink, the, oh, from way earlier? Oh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hold on. Let me bring it up. <laughs> I don't know if it's still here. Oh, my goodness. Yes, from way back, way back. I think, I think this one is sold, but let me check here. We are, it's always worth checking. You're talking about this one, Amanda? Yes. That one with the big fingerprint on it? Yes. yes. <laughs> Ooh. That was so much gold. You could make out that entire fingerprint. That was like, you could see it all. Look at this here. This is for, I, I don't think it's still available. We'll check for you. We'll check. Uh, operators know better than I do. And then we'll bring back the diamond ring and we're going to blow that out. Somebody's got to have this men's ring, so we're going to make it happen. It was just a flash, but it's turning into a, a mission. It's a mission. Here's the carrot and a half. Yeah. What's he think? Yeah. Oh boy, that's extra money, Greg. That's going to cost you. That's, yeah, that's, that's only, yeah, because you know, if he's waiting for us to have a men's ring without an undergallery, it's going to be a long while. We don't have many that don't have an undergallery, right? It's got it. It's got the undergallery. It's got this mirror finished quilted styling. It's got 48 points. So that means two carats almost. 
Hey, Tiffany, I, if he likes it, I better do this off air. Otherwise, I'm going to upset some people because this ring, I had it only about a week ago when it debuted and it was $99.99. I came along and blurted out a price like $49.99. You remember that? I was here. Guess what it is. Do you like it too? Yeah. Okay. So Tiffany and James, I have two people on the lines. I only have one ring. I'm going to give you an off air because this makes me feel bad. I had this at $49.99, Tony, like last week. And I am seriously going, not a little bit, a lot lower, a lot lower. Tiffany, here's what I'm going to do for Greg, okay? That's it. That's it. We're blowing it out. It's a carat and a half center stone. Whoa, that's big. That's a big deal stone right there. And then it's got the 48 points, and then it's got the finishing, and you can change the gold if you want. You can change the gold color, but that's a huge blowout. And two people, one ring. So this is getting intense. Let me try it on for you as well. And then, okay, then we're getting to our tanzanite. I promise we'll get you that tanzanite in the bridge, but this is too spectacular to stay here. That is just simply, I, I had this and I was like literally screaming from the rooftops of this stage last week going, yeah, no, I can't do that. We don't have time and I've already reduced it, huh? I can't. <laughs> Only if we start at $5,000, James, but I don't think they want to do that. No, we've got, we've got two, three callers now. Three callers, one ring. So who will get it? That's the big question. Who will own it? Yes. Uh-oh. Two callers, one ring. Huh? Yeah, well, it was five. remember when it was $5,000 and everyone was saying, oh, could you go a little bit lower? And we could not do it. And now I'm just blowing it out. I'm, blow, I, I'm a little on a time crunch here because nine minutes ago, I was supposed to be showing you a Tanzanite and Bridge. So I'm trying to make this a quick, quick deal. And we'll see who's got it. Congratulations if you do. I do have fun diamond earrings, by the way. So for the gals, we're not leaving you out of the fun loop here. We've got a fun diamond pair of earrings drops coming up. Do not miss out on that value. It's a carat and a half diamond, so there's only so low they can go. Yeah. Um, so, so the diamond is it like level? No. There's a tiny, tiny elevation to the center stone, and that's where you can see that. Do you see that there? The center stone will be prong set slightly above the pave of the white diamonds. The pave of the white diamonds are flush with the gold. The center stone is prong set, but it's, it's, it's minor. I mean, we're talking about a very minute elevation here. Nothing that sits up high, nothing that's going to be, you know, it's a men's ring. It's not, you know, it's not like, you know, that's oftentimes men's rings are sit lower and women's rings sit higher. And that's kind of what often dictates men's or ladies rings is how they are set for the center stones. I can't believe this isn't spoken for at this moment. <laughs> I think it will be, but it's just taking a moment. So anyway, grab an off air if you want to see what that's all about. I think you're going to be really impressed. All right, next up. So our top of the hour is here. Thanks, Greg. Thanks for letting us show it to you. It's really a fun ring. And, and again, it, it's just a big difference because it's a carat and a half. So that's the largest fun diamond I have in stock. So top of the hour is here, Tony. We're just going to say hello to everybody and make sure everyone is uh, ready for a little tanzanite. Of course, do call us. We're still verifying, so I don't know if that one's found a home just yet, but we're verifying, so you're more than welcome to call in on the off air. If you'd like to get it, please do. There is a great, great, I've previewed this. I think a lot of people have been waiting for this, but I will have to do something incredible, which is what we kind of, I think What's New Wednesday should be just called like Wild and Wonky Wednesday because we do some really stupid things with pricing. I mean, everything, nothing has been priced as planned, if that makes any sense, because the prices that were intended when I came on the air at seven o'clock tonight, I don't think there's been one that has been stuck. So we just really are um, really doing some wild things to make sure pieces get out the door. So if there's anything you want to shop for, uh, holler at us, tell us, give us your request. We only have less than an hour left. And that is why this Tanzanite must be seen right now. We've got a major, major Tanzanite. This is the big bridge. So this is a big deal, and I know you've been waiting patiently. Thank you. It's, I know, a couple minutes behind uh, from where, where we're going to show it, and I got wonky wheels. I got wonky deals. I got a little bit of everything going on. There's a theme to it, right? So here's item number four. One, four, four. And take a look at the red flash coming through because it is divine. We've got a 476 blue wing black D Tanzanite. Gosh, this is a good-looking stone, isn't it? Four carats, 76. And then the big bridge has a carat 28 in VS diamonds.
The big bridge has four rows in VS diamonds that run through and underneath the ring. Then there are two other rows, top and bottom, six rows in total. Look at this. And the finishing is exceptional, except for the fingerprints in the back, which I will polish for you. This is 476 carat 28. And all that means is I'm looking at a mounting here alone, $5,300. $16, meaning the whole ring, I flipped it over and there it is from 13 to $89.99. So that is what I'm supposed to convey to you. And then theoretically, we're supposed to have, <laughs> if this was like a normal deal, we would have somebody call in and say, I'll take that ring for $89.99 and then we size it and ship it to you for free. And then you say, I call me in a couple days and hopefully say you love it. That's how that's supposed to work. But right now, we got nobody. $89.99, we're still talking about the men's ring with quite a few callers, right? We're talking about it. It'll go. This one's at $89.99 with not a whole lot of room to move, but I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. It's the last hour of the show. We're down to 45 minutes in the show, and we would love to welcome you in to the world of Blue Wing, the Lock D, best of tan tonight. But this is not a small stone, so I get it. You know, these are usually $89.99, and that's on a good day, and we're doing a deal, and we've got a special value, and you can call me if you love it. But I think we can sweeten the deal here since we want to get everybody on the phone lines here in our last 45 minutes and make sure this gets a home, because at $89.99 tonight, it's iffy. <laughs> so guess what we can do? And if I can't discount it on my own any further than I just did, there's a loophole that I like to use that allows us to get you a better opportunity. So here's what I'll do. It's not going to be $89.99. I want to see you out there on Wednesday night with us in our last 45. I, I do have to kind of consider the cost and then say, okay, we'll go on. You saw the cost of the mounting, 53.16, right? Yep, 53.16 right on the bag. And then you add a five carat tanzanite, essentially. This is our most labor intense mounting we do. It's the big bridge we do. It's the multiple, multiple four rows just underneath and one row top and bottom. And then your stone just sitting high above it all. Projecting the neon that no other tanzanite but blue wing black D's do. The red flashes, in it's just insane, crazy. And then you get the brilliance of the diamonds through the stone. So it's a fascinating way to set a tanzanite that is the literal best in the world. Here's what I'll do. Instead of $89.99, I really want to do something wild here, but uh, there's only so much I can discount. So here's what I'll do. I'll put it on the auction block. We'll see who's out there, but I'm not going to start, not even starting at $6,000 or $5,000 or $4,000, which is already less than half. And you guys know, a normal auction start price should be right around half of the discount we do. So if it's going less than that, you got an opportunity, but I realize it's the last few minutes of the show, so we got to go wild here. Not even $4,000 to open. I really want to get everybody in. Not even $3,500 to open. We're now about $2,000 less than the mounting by itself. Let's start at $3,000. Not happened on a 4K at 76, but it's happening right now. So for my Tanzanite lovers, if you've been waiting for a gorgeous, really rich, really important, really superstar Tanzanite, might I can I just have you consider this, especially at $3,000 to open. Take a look at it. We got one short minute, thank you, to get the open, and we'll see where it goes. But that is, Tiffany, what did Greg think about that diamond? Good. Oh, he doesn't, okay. He wants it inside the mounting blush? Is that what he wants? Yes, it is. Uh huh. So he doesn't want that? Okay, got it. Got it. Good, good, good. All right. Hmm? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm thinking we can try to, I, I can, what I can do is if he really likes it, I could try to do that for him. What? Yeah, so that's my goal. So let me see if I can do that, okay? We'll see if I can do that. Yep, that sounds good. That sounds good. We try, you know, we are the jeweler. So, you know, if anybody can do it, we should and we can, if at all possible, we'll make it happen for you. So $3,000 and we don't have it open. Okay, welcome to the last hour. <laughs> okay, we have Fawn Diamond earrings too. So I've got the Fawn Diamond drops, but I'm not sure I'm ready to give this up yet. I still have five more seconds of hope here. Five seconds of hope. 
And look at this. This is a mountain. You guys know it by now. If you've seen our show, you know this mounting with these incredible diamonds running underneath. Let me try this on if I may be so bold as to just try it on prior to even getting an auction open here just to give you a an idea of the status level of this design, the beauty and the intricacy of the way it's actually set all these different pieces of gold made separately to be brought together in this incredible bridge mounting. And we don't have an open yet, but I do have two people talking about it. So I'll give it a few extra seconds and we'll see because this happened last time. We had a really long delayed response to our auction. So let me see if we do have anybody that wants to come on in and help us out and get you a really, really, really cool discount because bottom line is it's an $89.99 piece. We got the buy it now up there, the original price 13278 but it was really $89.99 is what I had it for. That was my discount tonight. That was my discount. And now it's just... James, were you back there asking them by any chance if they could do that or? Oh, no, no. Okay. I oh, okay, great. I was just thinking maybe we could ask right now and give him a call back if we can do it. Right, why not? Why wait? We'll see if we can do it. Nothing but time. Waiting on this one. Don't have an open yet. That's okay. I'm really, really trying to give it away. <laughs> I'm really, really trying to give this one away. I'd like to. But again, without an open, I don't know who to send it to. You know what I mean? There's somebody out there who's saying, wait a minute, that's a huge value. There's a five carat stone with a carat plus, almost a carat and a third in diamonds what's going on? And again, we can't sell it without an open. So that's the big question here. That is key. Let's see. Could we bezel set this stone to make it completely flat in the mounting? Let's just see if we can do it for our, our great caller. Can we bezel set instead of prong setting it? Because I know the issue is it's probably a little too big right now, so we'd have to modify it. So we may have to start. Yeah, I, I, Greg, if you're watching and you'd like us to bezel set that for you, we can do it. So you know, we can just, we may have to start over, it may take a couple extra days because we might have to just make a new mounting for it, you know, and build it with the bezel. But, um, you know, Greg, we can do it for you. So yeah, let us know if that's what you want to do. All right, no open on this one. I move along. Coming up next, I've got one pair of diamond earrings for one collar. Take a look at this. We've got some superstar, and I mean stars. They look like fabulous firework stars, don't they? This is item number 3669. And welcome to our last hour of Wednesday, but our last really 40 minutes. So. Time crunch is here and we still have our eight carat diamond tennis bracelet. So beautiful. But one pair only. Yellow gold only, 3669, 42 points. B to the S. Diamonds, yellow gold only on this pair. It is for $439 for the pair. One collar, we'll give it 30 seconds. Whoever wants them, that is a really special opportunity on some beautiful, again, larger, they're kind of brilliant and star-like. So this is the look on the hand here to give you an idea of the size because it is a larger uh, earring than we typically see. So you can see there how they, thank you, that's good. 439, 20 seconds, just a one and done, last opportunity. It's the last pair we have of this style. They kind of remind us, they're very reminiscent of the spark stars that we had once upon a time that were so crazy popular. So James, who is asking for a, oh, good. Does she, so he needs a fawn diamond? Did he see the other one? Did he see the other one we had on the wheel? Okay, so he wanted, oh, I gotcha. Okay, well, here's what I'll do. This one that he gave me is not less than the price. However, here's the deal. Walter, take a look. I have a fawn diamond here that I'm gonna do something wild on because you know if these requests come in, that's why I ask, because I really want to make sure we fit the request. No good to bring it out if it's going to be $3,800. 2768 is the item number. So Walter or anybody else, hear me out. This is a fawn diamond. Now, remember the last fawn diamond we had was a one carat, but it was just a halo of diamonds, 30 points in diamond. This one, a little smaller center stone, but it has a lot of diamonds on the side. This is a half carat with 68 points on the side. So you get a lot of diamonds total weight. It's a double halo. It's got diamonds down the shoulders in either direction. I will blow this out. It is late night officially. It is late night. We are ready to help you. And this is where some of the wildest values of the entire network happen is in the last couple of minutes of a Wednesday night show. Case in point, I'm going to prove it. I'm going to prove it right now. Here's a $3,899 ring. That's not what Walter asked for. 
So this is what we brought out. It's a little smaller stone, but again, it's got all the white diamonds around it, so it makes it a little tough to make it super affordable, but I will. $38.99, ignore it, ignore it. I'm gonna give this 60 seconds. And if anybody would like it, we can switch out the gold for you. If you would like a yellow gold or rose gold instead, no problemo, we can do it for you. I'm gonna blow this out for Walter's request, but you know, to be fair, it's whoever says sold first. That's how we operate. So if you think you might like this ring, it is a classic, the double halo. This is how you see really important diamonds set. It's just usually their white diamonds, which are kind of your regular average diamond. This is a fawn diamond. Take a look, we're gonna blow it out. I'm gonna make this so like uh, uh, amazingly, shockingly low. It's going to be a matter of can you dial fast enough to get in on the deal. It is not 38. It is not 2000 and it's not even $1,500. He wanted less than right. That was the request. Get it less than 15. So watch what I'll do right now. It's a 3899 ring. This is what they brought out. I'm going to make it work for the requester or whomever says sold first. We're going to blow it out right now. The very first call you can have it for $999. I'm just going to make that. Yeah, I just, I need to see it go. I'm a little, I, I'll be honest with you. I'm a little bit shocked. There was no open on the Tanzanite and the bridge. So I got to do something crazy. There it is. $999 for a fawn diamond ring. These are only here at TV on, by the way. Nobody else has fawn diamonds except for us. Nobody. We have the private collection only here. We've done this with Tanzanite blue wings. We've done this with incredible spines that are color changing variety. And now the newest, latest, hottest of a fancy color diamond is right there. And the first caller at $9.99. I'm giving it away. Giving it away. And that piece alone, consider 68 points in VS Diamonds in a double halo and down the shoulders. Look at how stunning. That's not the important part. The important part is the fawn diamond in the middle that is exactly a half carat. All right. 45 seconds or until it sells. I think it'll be selling first, but, but you never know. Let me try it on for you. Show you that one on the hand. 40 seconds left. We're verifying and somebody's got to grab it. There is a value, just give away. It is all, but I mean, really, 50 point fun diamond by itself. You think that's gonna be 999 on its own? And then I got the earrings to match. This is perfect timing actually, because I have the earrings, what's that? That's a seven right now. It's a seven right now. I can size it all the way up or down how you need it. So let me show you earrings. Not just because you're saving a bundle on this one. You know, you are saving about 2,900 bucks on this ring, right? But let me show you earrings. I'm going to wait out the clock like I said I would. Four seconds remaining on that one. And then let me show you the earrings, which are brand new. And we have actual fun diamond earrings. I, I showed these earlier in relation to a champagne diamond ring that I had. And look at, look at, look at what's here. We went ultra I know this is probably something I should save for another day because when it's like prime time and everyone's not sleeping, but I will tell you right now, I can go ahead and combat this. And I, I know this is really, really one of the most important earrings we've ever had in the history of our show because I, I could show you emails by the dozen of emails I've received asking about fawn diamond earrings, but not in small sizes. We've had studs. I've done half carat total weight studs. I've done quarter carat total weight studs. But we've never had the big earrings like this. And I'll tell you, this is really cool because you're probably noticing those are not just fawn diamonds. They are pink diamonds around them and white diamonds around that in a lever back. The item number here is 2768. Wow. And you know, there's no mention on this information about pink diamonds at all. But those are pink diamonds, right? They're pink. There's literally no mention of it. That's going to save you some money right there. Let me zoom in on this one so you can see what I'm talking about because there's the fawn diamond in the center, which we know of as the champagne pink combo. Look at the pinks though. Those are clearly pink diamonds. They're not listed as pinks. You have four, three, you know what? I, I know I gave you the ring number. Four, three, six, one. I got two fawn diamonds. The ring may be gone. Let's talk about the new earrings. Four, yeah, four, three, six, one. I apologize. I gave you the, the previous items number. I'm ready to do the earrings now. We're ready to see what's going to go on. I just wanted you to see how this is made. Fawn diamond, which is a half carat each, so one carat total. You get 54 points in VS diamonds. There is no mention of pinks. That is going to help you out. There are white diamonds throughout the front of the lever back. The outer halo are white diamonds as well. Let's show you both now and show you what is so spectacular about an earring that I tell you nobody else in the world can create. And here's the main problem that I suspect. 
I promised I would get these in today. I, I have every reservation about doing this considering what I'm seeing here in the last few minutes and the pieces that are, you know, no open on the auction. I'll tell you what, I have a remedy to that. But here's an earring that I kid you not, just without 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 the center stones which are the most important part because large diamonds always dictate that's always going to lead the charge when it comes to rarity is the larger diamonds you have especially when they're natural fancy colors like our fawn diamonds that are matched up as a perfect pair we have one person thinking about them here's the problem i kid you not i was a little intimidated to put these up because they're very pricey i custom made one pair of fawn ear uh, earrings for a viewer about three months ago and you guys may remember them they were seventy five hundred dollars and they were gone in an instant. They were custom made. I worked with that viewer for probably three months on those earrings. And we worked on it and worked on it and worked on it. And they were 7,500 bucks. I have the drop, and those were studs. These are drops, not quite as large, but very large fawn diamonds. I'll tell you right now, I've got this pair. I should be getting tonight $6,899 for this pair tonight. And this has pink diamonds. It has pink diamonds around the fawn, white diamonds around the pink. So at $68.99, that is what I'm supposed to get. But I'll tell you, we're in our last half hour. And this is the most spectacular earring I've had in a while on this show. So here's what I'll do. This I don't need. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to try it again. I didn't even get, part of the reason I didn't want to put these up was because I didn't get an open on the Tanzanite auction. I'm going to try it again because I think if the earring is big enough and important enough and I start low enough, I think it's going to get a home. And that's my only goal here is to make sure that somebody out there loves the earrings and can get them tonight at a song. How about this? I'm not starting at 65 or 6,000 or 5,000 or 4,000 or 3,000 or 2,000. I need to get an open. I'm, I'm still a little sore about that tanzanite, so I need to get an open. So I'm going to do everything in my power to ensure that I do that, and I'm going to start at 1,500 bucks on fun diamond earrings with pink and white diamonds to go with them. We're starting at 15, out oh, that, that cost. I need to stop looking at that. We're gonna start at 15, go up in $100 increments. Take a look. This is why you're here to the very end of the show. What's that? No. Uh, wait, do they want the exact same thing with no pink diamonds? I don't have any right now. If you wanted this earring, Tiffany, I could, I would, I would absolutely save the universe by taking those pinks out and putting white diamonds in their place. I could do that. I could do that. <laughs> yes, so my point is we could, if you want to bid, we could customize these. If they just don't like pink diamonds, we could customize these and make them with white diamonds instead. And there are, after all, is no mention of pink diamonds anyways in this earring, and yet they're there. So that, that actually would be probably what it was, what it was intended to do all along. Yes. Sure, we can go get some. Yeah, we, I know we have a bunch. Did they say anything about shape? Uh, no shape? Could you just go back there and ask real quick so that I could see if we have any open on this auction and then, then we know what's going on? No open on this one either. Oh, boy. I tried. <laughs> I can't pay you. That's a, no, it's not allowed. I can't do it. Oh, I got in so much trouble once. <laughs> I literally said, I'll pay you. Just try them. Try them out. <laughs> 15, no open. Okay, we're checking on four here at Tansy Pendants. We have no open on the fawn pink diamond ear. Oh gosh, oh goodness, this cannot be happening. Yeah. Yeah. Well, here's the problem I have right now. There's no mention of the pink diamonds in the earring. I'm taking a $7,000 pair of earrings and I'm pricing them or auctioning them at 15 to open. Is she basically saying I want another discount? Because I, I just don't know how I can uh, how I can actually square that. <laughs> I mean, I'm willing to say you can open them and we'll modify them for you. But um, yeah, it's not going to get cheaper than this. I, I hate to say that, but it's just, yeah, I'm pretty low here. <laughs> the idea was to start really low. I was waiting until we got our open, but let's show it on the hand here. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. We've got a beautiful movement. So there's an O-ring that's going to attach to the lever back to the base and then you've got let me show you the measurement here as well we'll get you a look at the length which is going to be one inch and of course the drop of the fawn this is really looking pink from this angle isn't it the fawn diamonds which have the champagne the pink so we have the open there at 15. 
Okay, so we have the open. Thank you so much. $1,500 has been bid. I mean, does she, under, I, I hate to sound like, I know that sounds weird, but there's literally no mention of pink diamonds anyways, as I was kind of remarking on earlier. I, I wish I could like say, hey, there's another thousand dollars off because you want the pinks replaced to white. But honestly, the labor I think will suffice to, you know, we can do it for you. If you don't want pink diamonds, we can, we can do it. It's just, that's going to be an, another additional labor charge, which we're not going to charge you for. Does that make sense? Yeah, we do. Tiffany decided that she would, she would just, yeah, just pity. It's a pity bid. Yeah. I, like I said, we will. We will. We can do it. I've already verified it. We checked it on the spot. I won't charge him extra for that, James. James, the only issue is instead of going out tomorrow, it probably will take us an extra few days to do it because we're probably going to have to start over on the mounting. 16 has been bid. 16 has been bid. 16. Tiffany, we got a challenger here at 16. Uh, I know it's late, but I was still starting this low. I was really honestly anticipating getting a lot of bidders. I'll tell you what we'll do. I'm going to give it a clock right now because I have about 25 minutes and I have a lot more to show you. To be honest, this is clearly, I, I, think, I'm, I think we're clear here. This is going to lose some money. So at this point, to me, if you'll, under, if you'll please like level with me, I, it doesn't matter now if we're losing like, you know, 4,500 or 4,800. It, it doesn't really matter right now. <laughs> Right now, we're losing. You win, we lose. So I'm just going to save a little bit of air time and try to show you some other pieces, and we'll sacrifice these. We'll sacrifice them. So what I'm going to do, I th we might be verifying back there. Again, I'll, I'll extend the opportunity to everybody. Tiffany's bidder, who was opening the auction, said I would really just, it's a personal preference thing. If you would really just prefer white diamonds, I'll do it. We'll switch them all out. There's no, literally no mention of pink diamonds on the bag anyways, so they weren't priced with pink diamonds. Not to mention they were $7,000 almost and I'm, I'm at 16. So there is value from every single angle of this auction right now. It's just a matter of getting you in before we sell them out, okay? So in two minutes, we'll do that. In two minutes, we're going to give it the final call right now. It's only $100 increments for anybody who wants to jump in and play. You can certainly go higher than that. Oh my goodness, would we appreciate that. But again, I think we're going to be at a loss here. No matter what, I think that's a, a safe assumption and a fair bet. So. Here we are, and if you want to be the beneficiary of that, and you want to save literally thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars off the TV on price to get yourself some of our best of the best earrings we've ever created, then be my guest. Two minutes to dial in. Take a look at these earrings. Fawn diamonds, pink diamonds, white diamonds, and the very complicated labor intense lever back as well. Thank you so much. All right, so we will have, Anthony, if you want to just, I don't know if you want to have them call back just in case we get anybody who wants to bid on the, on the auction. I don't know. But, um, oh my gosh, James, I can tell you that's just not going to, that's not going to work. <laughs> 16, final 90 seconds left. Amanda, are you thinking about these earrings? Anybody else want to come on in to play or give themselves maybe a shot, a shot here to own the fawns with the pinks, with the white, which we'll, again, if you want, just explicitly tell us, I don't want pink diamonds, I just want white diamonds. You know why we do it with the pinks, with the fawns, is because the fawn diamonds, as, are, as I've always said, they're this rare color of, of champagne and pink together. So having the pink halo really accentuates that. It brings it out. It gives you this more unique fat. I mean, let's face it, you got unique stones from the beginning at the bullseye there, but you extend out and by adding pinks, you just add more rarity and more luxury to these already way <laughs> underpriced earrings. I, I, I like what's going on here. The front row, nothing auction related, just James dancing in his chair has pretty much made my night here. It's all right. Yeah. I'm, I, suddenly it doesn't seem so bad that we're losing you know, four or $5,000 on the earrings. I don't want to think about it. I don't want to calculate it. I'm just going to know it's a loss. Someone wins, we lose. It's great, you know? It's really cool. So last call, we've got our final, final clock. So yeah, it's like now or never time if you want to dial in and jump in, this is the time to do it. And then Anthony, they're still on the line waiting on the tan tonight. We'll do that next. We'll do that next. And here we go. Let's see if we've got $1,700, yay or nay. We are about to find out. Adrienne's out. Out? All of that for nothing. Okay, so do we have 17? Okay, okay. Sold. Congratulations. That's gone. Those are gone, I should say. It's a pair of earrings. I know, for that price, it should be one. It should be half a one. Take a look. Anthony, who's your caller there looking for a tan tonight? Oh, you're
you're not on. Oh, never mind. Okay. I thought maybe you were waiting on the tanzanite because I just asked you and you said yes. <laughs> So this is for our Tanzanite requester, who I'm not sure who that is yet, because he's in the middle of a phone call. But this is 3402, and it is uh, a three carat 64 blue wing block D. And so I thought, now I don't know if you have a certain shape that you really are going for, let us know, we can try and find it. But this is about that range. Uh, three carat 64 with the VS diamonds is like a floral effect going on. And that is the little bit of leaves there that you have at the base and then all the pave up top, which is really, again, a beautiful, beautiful bale that is fashioned and functioned together because it's not a utilitarian bale that's added as an afterthought. It's all part of the design. So it's really pretty and seamless and flows and just looks great with this big 364. And I'll blow it out right now. If you'd like that tansy, we'll do it for $1,999. We have about 20 minutes left. So certainly a lot of jewelry can go out the door and will in this last 20 minutes when we do these rock star prices we've got for you. And last minute for request too, if you got requests you'd like to get in, it's not too late yet to get those requests in. We'll help you out. We'd love to help you out with those requests. If there's anything we can find for you or better yet, if you if there's something you can't stop thinking about from the show and you want to get in as a last call opportunity. But that is for our Tanzanite requester, 19.9. It's about all we have in that size. We have quite a few that, that are, if you're okay with five carats, we have quite a few that go into the five carat, six carat range and beyond, but that's about it. Who was it, Anthony, looking for the Tansy? Do you know who it was? Oh, okay, new register. So let us know if you like that one. And like I said, I can always make something special for you if that doesn't uh, really hit the spot. Yeah. A pendant and a bridge? Um, we haven't before, but that's an intriguing idea. I don't know where the bridge would really end. Okay, we'll work on it. I like when you guys play designer. Yeah. A carrot 89? I do remember them. They're the white, they're still back there. Yeah, they are. They're the um, 18 karat gold VS. They were a cluster, big cluster. Yeah, we'll see if we can bring them out. Yeah, yeah, we do have them. They're still here. Tiffany, did you have a question? Yeah. Uh, what's the theme, the style? I mean, how are you going to execute that particular style? That I, I don't know, um, but shouldn't take long. Shouldn't maybe only add one day to the typical shipping time. Yeah, yeah, because that's, that's all done in-house. No problem. And James, did the, oh, look, I won't interrupt. The font diamond, did you need to see that again, or is it gone? It's exactly gone. Yeah, okay, thank you. Just want to make sure he didn't see that again. All right. So let me know if you like this one. I want to show you, we're going to try to get these requests out here on those earrings really quick. I'd love to get those to you. Uh, another look before we go. Do have a major discount on an emerald. Major, major, major. You're going to like this emerald. So we'll blow that out too. And I do have a pink diamond that's certified as well. So that's going to be coming up. And did want to remind you about this. Our eight carat O2 eye clean white diamond tennis bracelet. The largest we have had in the diamond tennis bracelet is right there. And that is our 802, just a reminder, because I know a lot of you have asked to think about it, and I know we're at the last couple of minutes of the show here. Item number is 4462 on our 18 carat. So remember, this is all seven inches. It is white gold only, which is, I think, how usually you want to show off diamonds of this kind of level. And these are really nice diamonds, you know. Sometimes yellow gold is a mechanism you use to hide a poorer quality diamond or a mediocre quality diamond. These are not. These are eye clean stones. They're actually 802 total weight. And you've got all of that spectacular 18 karat solid gold. And it's also a seven inch. So hopefully the size that you need, it is a really great value. We've knocked it down from what should have been $96,000 in a, a very conservative retail environment. And instead, we've got it all the way down to $9,999 unheard of for huge diamonds like this all the way through a bracelet. So something to think about while we're working on bringing out those white diamond clusters from Monday. We're going to bring those back out if we find them and hopefully we will. So that's going to be on the way for you. $9,999 on this bracelet and take a look at it on the wrist here as well just to see that size because it's the size that is so overwhelming here. It's the size that really makes the statement. I mean, this is what you typically don't see in a bracelet is this type of diamond weight throughout.
look at that. There's half of your closure there. Remember, this has got a fold under style clasp, which I'm going to show you on this side here. This is actually going to be, you see this, this edge here, that's actually going to fold under. So once it's locked into place, you fold this under, you'll hear it click and you know it's locked. So it makes for a very smooth, seamless kind of closure that still gives you the security of knowing that is locked because you don't want anything happening to an eight carat diamond tennis bracelet, right? So there it is, our eight carat eye clean stunning and, and when you look at this up close you do realize okay this is I mean everyone's asking about color look at those colors I mean if there was any kind of body color whatsoever you would see it against the white gold and against the white background and you can see how white and clean they are again I clean stones throughout and any questions on it let us know and Amanda you have a question I think our Tanzanite pendant is verifying as well. That beautiful pear-shaped Tanzanite pendant. Loving that one as well. And then don't forget about our museum wheel. We're going to try to get that in. Just want to make sure we get ample, uh, ample time for those requests as well. Before we go, there is a huge blowout on a pink diamond that is even certified. And I've got one of our deluxe emeralds out of Colombia. Let's take a look. It's our 333. That is just sounds that just sounds like numerically very lucky, doesn't it? And hello, look at this emerald. Real quick before we go, um, you know what I'm going to do? I, I took this off the museum wheel. I just want to show you individually. I think it's important to see some of these pieces individually instead of on a wheel. So I'll tell you what, 3038 is the ad number. We're very busy on our phone lines here. We're trying to work on a dream for your caller. Who is your requester on those diamond earrings, by the way? So, okay, Linda, we're, we're working on it and we'll see if we can bring those out. I hope, 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 hope they can find them. And this is our 333 with 56 points in VS diamonds. That is one of our spectacular best in a Colombian emerald because of the size and the clarity that are working together. There's an incredible value coming your way here. 56 points in VS Diamonds, yellow gold only. This is a uh, one heck of a blowout, one major blowout. So they're from the 18 karat gold designer line. I know they're here. Oh, is that the item number? You know it? Okay, do you know what they look like? They're a very big cluster. They're all white gold. They're from Monday. They're not out here. They're not out here but they are a cluster. They're really big round brilliance and then round brilliance around it. So they're big, they're big. They're about a half an inch diameter and they're an 18 karat gold and they were on Monday. Yeah, I know, they're hard to forget. <laughs> they're hard to forget, that's for sure, yeah. So this emerald will blow it out. <laughs> we'll blow it out. Make it just, you know what? Look at this. I mean, this is the bag. It's got a lot going on, right? But there's where it started. And then boom and boom and what, 47, 77, 39, 99. I'm just gonna say bye to all those prices and we're gonna get it a home right here, right now. It's a superstar, 333. So yeah, that was the lowest price was 39.99. I'll tell you what, I'll blow it out right now. 29.99, we'll make it really easy for you right now. 29.99 for one caller and this is just, I mean, right through and through and through. It's not so many times with emeralds, you just, you hope to get a little gleam of glow. You just want a little glint of it. A little, a little, just something, just something, right? This is the whole darn stone is glowing from the inside all the way out to the perimeter and watch this from a distance because from a distance is gonna really show off. Look at that stone. See what I mean? This is spectacular. The kind of emeralds that are truly museum worthy, that should be in a display case, behind bulletproof glass, under halogen lights. This is that kind of emerald. $29.99, that's it my friends. That's it, May's birthstone at its very best. And it's only one in the world. And it is yellow gold only on this one. It does have an under gallery. Let me show you the finishing on the inside as well. So you can see, oh yeah, oh yeah, perfection. It even looks, it's such a rich gold. It looks like 18 karat, doesn't it? It's so buttery in the color. Fully, oh, look at this, look at the depth of even the band from the side. You can see how rich and deep that gold is. And this glowing stone, which is just mega, mega, mega. 29 dollars 
for one caller. I, I don't know who's there. I think we have three people verifying on one ring here and that you know with emeralds they're always one only is that's the deal you can't really duplicate emeralds very well and and speaking of i'll go ahead and prove my point wrong <laughs> we actually have an, a pair of earrings from earlier which i'll remind you of that go with this ring really 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 well so just a a quick reminder if you do want that bright color and there it is in an earring we've got the ovals in an earring for you which that pair of earrings was only 888 so a reminder there i actually think they go really really well and we've actually saved you so much money uh, it's like the earrings are a freebie and you're still saving money so that's the pair of earrings that might go really nicely as a coordinator uh, coordinating set if you wish but that is one good looking emerald they very rarely look like that it's a treat to see any kind of color any kind of glow remember the earrings are only 888 if you'd like those. So 888 for the earrings, 2999 for the ring. What a great set. I mean, it's again, you could search far and wide for years at a time looking for emeralds like this um, to even just not just the two to go in the earrings, but the one in the ring and then to put them all together is why that's so special. It's just a tough, tough stone to match up in any kind of set opportunity. So it's really nice to see those there. Anyway, $29.99 on the ring. That should not be here. It's such a big markdown. And you saw it was already gone through a whole round of markdowns over and over and over and over. So to bring it down to a new low like this is pretty good. And it was all supposed to be $99.99 at the lowest. So it just kept on tumbling. But that's what happens. These really big stones that go for $16,000 a carat are very, very important. So you got to really just truly mega opportunity. And again, the earrings, you don't have to get them both. I just think they look so fine together. And the shape, I think it's totally fine to mix and match your shapes. I think that's really actually better because then I think, you know, I think if you actually have everything that kind of looks cookie cutter, I think it tends to cheapen the look a little bit. So I like when you get the same color, but then you have the different shapes. And again, these earrings, just the ovals lend themselves well to earrings. They really work with the halo. You got the gorgeous ring. That is one to take advantage of. Love the set. I really just, again, this one's first known. It's a tricky one. It really is tricky to get that kind of quality and, and just seeing all this beauty and all that color and the incredible, incredible thickness of the band too. I mean, that's just anchored beautifully on the hand so that it sits well and sits evenly and just, you know, it's one of the finest emeralds we have here. So huge value there. $29.99 for the ring, $8.88 for the earrings. You can get one or the other. Totally a la carte is fine. That's totally fine as well. Just a matter of getting them before somebody else does. That's the key. That's the big key here. So here's our last chance. Any last requests we can get to? I know we're working on those earrings, Linda, so stay with us. It's looking iffy, but hopefully. And then I'll blow out a pot of Eva. End of the show. Perfect time to take one of our biggest and best pot of Eva's and blow it out. You ready for this? One of our big ones here and a fine 262. The item number on this one is 800-9227. And this is going to be something. End of the show special here. We've saved one of our best for last for you. An incredible value and ultimately real blue on this stone. You know, Pataibas are usually some semblance of blues and greens in their signature color. Uh, but this is really a, quite a bit more blue than we typically see, which is very rare. You do have a carrot 33 on the sides as well. And it is all just for one and one alone. So here's what you can do. Uh, I'm going to blow it out for you. And this is how our Pata Iba ro deals roll. And we've had some really good ones lately that are just second to none as far as the big sizes getting really low in price. This one started out $16,358. And then it came down to $11,999. All of that does not matter when you've got nine minutes left in your show on a Wednesday night and you are determined to get the values to the best they've ever been. And this stone is certainly exceptional, right? The neon color is there. The beauty of the clarity is there. This has a really nice great split shank and then they put a large diamond in the middle as well, which really just takes it classic. It's a definite timeless piece of jewelry, but it's not going to be 12,000 and it's not going to be anywhere anywhere near it at all. We have one in the world. And I've done this lately on a few of our big Paraibas. And I'll tell you, it is one of my greatest pleasures to bring you Paraibas, especially in the big sizes, and knock them down in price. We've been doing it a little bit lately here and there on some of our really pristine stones. Just because they've been here a little while, we're kind of giving it just a really great opportunity to get them gone. And this is your chance where if you've been eyeing these or thinking about these, or you just, sometimes you just know it when you see it. You know, when you find the perfect stone, we show you more Paraibas than anybody. So sometimes, you know, when you, you're debating which one is the perfect one for me, 
Sometimes it's just about that kind of emotional reaction you have when you see a piece of jewelry and you know it. You know it. And those are the pieces you take advantage of, especially when these prices. I realize we have eight and a half minutes left in the show. We're going to take a look at this. It is not going to be $12,000. I've got a major discount to send this flying out of here right now. And it's not even going to be 12 or 10. It is just one of those ultimate lows on Pata Eva's when we don't usually see them come down to this level. It's your chance right now to own it. And the key here to be on the phone lines early, watch this on the hand. It is not going to be anywhere near 10 or nine or eight or seven or $6,000. We got the big Pata Eva here and see when that light is blocked, the stone still glows. We're going to blow it out right now. The very first caller on this one. I'm not even doing 6,000 or 59.99. This is truly some of the biggest bang for your buck you've ever had the opportunity to own in the rare, rare Pata Eba copper bearing tourmaline. And it's not even going to be 59.99. One caller. And here's your opportunity of a lifetime. They don't come down this low and we are just gifting it at the end of the show tonight. $5,499 on that one. $54.99 on this Pata Eba, a $262 and a carat 33 in VS Diamonds. That is a dandy. And I will say that $262, having seen three carats and four carats recently, that stone is just as large dimension wise as the three and the four carats we've seen of late. It, it really, really is. So it gives you, it delivers even more bang for your buck visually and dimension wise than a 262 ordinarily does. And obviously anything rare in that size in Paraiba. A one carat is rare in Paraiba. When you get the actual honest to goodness copper bearing material, which you have here, and it's that unbelievably distinctive, unique color, which you have here, more blue than it is green, which is incredibly rare. Generally what the collectors really, really, really look for are those crazy, crazy rare colors when you do actually tip the scale of having more blue than green. That's the key there. So that's really important. And 50, what, $54.99, incredible value on that one. I would not miss it if I were you. So they're like a cluster, mm -hmm. a cluster of huge diamonds. They were the 18 karat gold designer line. They look like this. And then they've got the little diamonds around them, but they're quite large. Okay. 18K, white gold. Yeah. yeah. Fifty, or probably yeah. She'll see him tomorrow. She'll see him tomorrow. Unless, did we find him? Okay, we have five minutes. Linda, are you still with us? Yeah. Well, they. I know. I tried to convey that they're big. <laughs> they're big. All right, let's show them. We got them, Linda. All right, Linda. Here they are. Take a look at this. I'm so glad we got them in time for you because I really do want to show you <laughs> a good look at them. For, I think the drawing helped. I went back there and drew them. That, that might have helped. <laughs> I'd like to think it helped. Um, here are the big earrings I had on Monday for you that we debuted. Now, this is from that designer line where everything's 18K. So this is item number 4450, and they are finished in the back. They're 18 karat solid gold, but what the big deal is, yeah, they're like the biggest earring we've done. It's 18 karat with a carat 89. Item number 4450, they should, yeah, they come up because we had them on Monday. 189 in diamonds, white gold only, but that's what makes the look because when you see these from afar, look at how they do just look like one I mean really it looks like one huge diamond with a halo around it that's the beauty of the shared prong design that you have here so almost two carats white gold and we're blowing them out right now they were 57.99 and I know we're going to make this a lot easier and a lot more affordable and and I do need you to see the diameter because like I said <laughs> this is why they were a little bit tough to find you know when you say stud earring or button earring we're looking for something generally smaller than this this is a whole half inch in diameter and you can see it's a barely little bit of movement I'm giving it you can see how they just are just bright sparkling and beautiful I'm blowing them out for $2,499 right now 
$24.99. I'm so glad we're getting you a good look at them here. Not too rushed at the end of the show. $24.99, one pair only. Let's go back to the wheel. And I want you to look at the precision in which these are set. And then you can see it's got almost like a flower pattern. And the post is centered. Congratulations on those. So let's do a tiny recap. It's going to be brief. That's for sure. And I'll just kick it off with that Pataiba you just saw. If you need an extra moment with that one, also have the emerald. I have this gorgeous emerald. You saw this. These are all just going to kind of recent late night pieces here, but we don't want to leave them here. We don't want to put them back in a vault. We'd much rather size them and ship them out to you tomorrow. Look at the big diamond bracelet, the eight carat diamond tennis bracelet still here and still in contention for you. So we've got that one. A lot of people thinking about it, making their decisions here at the end of the night. Also have the um, Tanzanite. I don't know the Tanzanite, the bridge. I think that one is just a uh, uh, kind of a weird anomaly didn't get an open on the auction earlier, but if you'd like to discuss it, we certainly can. I did have the sapphire earlier as well. This is a sapphire. If you missed it, it was way early in the show. First hour, we had this unbelievable certified stone. It is a sapphire. That ring is sixteen hundred ninety nine dollars. I can't even believe that that ring with the cert from the AIGS is actually $1,699. We have two and a half minutes left of the show. So if there's anything you want to discuss or talk about, this is the time to do it. We have this fabulous diamond bracelet over eight carats. It's our largest ever. Got this one under $5,500 for the Paraiba. There's the blue sapphire, which is down to uh -huh, $1,699 with the cert. Our emerald is $29.99 and then that tanzanite. Let's talk about it. There's the big, almost five carat tanzanite that is down to, let's see, well, we've got two minutes left in the show. So if we can discuss anything there with you, we'd be happy to do it. Also, don't forget, we had those gorgeous Tahitian Baroque pearls in strands. Those were down to $8.88. If you'd like that in white or yellow gold for your clasp, our last two minutes is here. So any questions you have, feel free to give us a call. We'll be here after the show as well to take your calls, answer your questions, and help you out with anything you need. And uh, I would highly recommend anything up there and to think that everything up here, including the bracelet under $10,000 and the Paraiba is under 55 and the Sapphire under 1700 for a certified Sapphire that looks like that. It's incredible. And uh, don't forget, we have 90 minutes or 90, 90 minutes, 90. I know James went, what? No. <laughs> 90 seconds left. And don't forget, our shows continue. Now I can say for the rest of the week, right? Because we have, oh yeah, don't forget, we have a new Saturday show. And by the way, for those of you that didn't get us on Saturday, Time Warner, Fios, Spectrum, all those guys, they couldn't get us up and running, but you will be with us this Saturday, so join us. Um, also remember that Tara's with you tomorrow. She sees you every Thursday, so she'll be here for a Thursday show for you. And then I've got Friday with you guys, and don't forget to watch us online on Friday. And then Saturday, our newest show here. Join us on Saturday morning. It's our daytime show, afternoon for the East Coasters. Make sure you know Saturday. We're shopping on Saturdays and Sundays now at the same time, 1 to 4 p.m. Eastern. So just a little update on, I know we've added some new, um, new viewership and some new airtime for you. So we'll shop all weekend long, Friday night into Saturday morning into Sunday morning. And of course, all of you guys can get all the values of a lifetime that we're known for. So we're thrilled that you can join us for giving you a little more uh, opportunity to shop the values you love. So thank you so much for joining us tonight. 30 seconds left. A lot of phone calls coming in. We'll be here after we go off the air. We're not going anywhere. So you can call us, jot down that number and we'll talk about anything up there or beyond. And that bracelet, incredible value on that bracelet. Who sees eight carats and diamonds for under 10 grand in 18 karat gold. Amazing value. Thank you all one and all for being with us on this fabulous Wednesday night. We hope you have a wonderful rest of your evening and of course a fabulous tomorrow. And then of course, Tara will see you tomorrow and I'll see you guys on Friday for the big marathon beginning. Thanks everybody. Have a great night. I'm Lauren Blair, and we'll see you soon. Yeah. The bracelet is $9,999. Yep. And 18 karat gold. So Greg was happy with the fawn. Yeah, that we're going to modify. Perfect. <laughs> no, he's like really gone. <laughs>